maybe a little one. And this just in from the officers, the prime minister's office. Um, <clears throat> I'm sorry, guys. The, the whole chaos thing. It seems that the idea was that uh, we could rebreak the arm and make it mend better. It's all just—it's getting worse. It's just getting worse and worse and worse. So I'm I'm resigning, and I'm going to give it over to this uh, Gibbon. Um, good luck. What do you got me? I'm gonna uh I'm gonna go drink myself to death. Maybot out <laughs> <laughs> Alright rule boy, shut up and welcome to the Pot Topic Podcast. I am your host Tom and with me our other host we have Luke. Hello there. We have Greg. <clears throat> <clears throat> yes. And we have Johnny. How be? And we have Taryn. Hey, 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 hey. It's magic. You know. Oh, nice. No, no, I was going to Yeah, I thought you were doing Artists of Fear as well. Yeah. Okay. Boom, wow. Boom, boom, oh, please. Wow. Can we get my song sung by James Hetfield? That would be so much better. Your song. Oh, 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 it's magic. <laughs> you know. <laughs> yeah. I thought you meant Elton John. Oh, this <laughs> is a <the> song. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, oh always musical believe mood, in your goals. <laughs> <laughs> I well forgot to cut. Up, I well forgot to cut up the topic, so I'm going to do this intro whilst cutting up topic. Oh, okay, yeah, sweet. Like, let's. Uh, so, uh, you know, you, you get on with that. I'll do the intro. Welcome to the Pot Topic Podcast. We uh, we talk about shit for two hours, pulling shit out of the pot. Before that, though, we do it all while drinking uh, whiskey. Greg, what have we got, brother? Well, today from the magical land of Japan, we've got Nikki. Nikki, Nikka, <laughs> whiskey from the barrel, which is directly from the barrel. It's only, a, it's a small bottle, but it packs a punch at 50, gonna, 51%. Oh yeah, baby. And we, I mean, with five of us around the table, that's basically enough for a quadruple each. But it's all right. There's yeah. a reserve to come. <laughs> uh, mate, don't, don't, Tom don't. Tom has many scissors he's, in he's his wielding, So he's wielding the most useless thing uh, I've ever been convinced to buy. I think that's out of mark. That's that. That is a pe- fucking yeah. Slap the Cyberpunk 2077 logo on it. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> it's a pair of herb scissors. So it's like oh, a it's it's like a five bladed. Yeah, no, it look, looks like a wicked idea. Do you know what it does? It cuts your herbs too big. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah. So I mean, so with a with a 50 cl as this bottle is. Um, and it's also a screw top. Well done. Oh man. yeah, yeah. Let's let's have the uh, the well, spine. When you make it that good, you don't need to put all the cork in there. I mean, <laughs> not my mantra. That was... I, I don't know what to make of that. Anyway, let's all have our quadruple of, of powerful whiskey and uh, see where this fucking shit takes us. <laughs> Happy Saturday afternoon, everyone. <laughs> Tarzan. Uh, yeah, so what have people been up oh. to? Um, right now, mostly this. This whiskey. <laughs> this is everything. <laughs> I think. Wh- whiskey I think is life. All, all before, all stretching out. Pretty much just naked. It is, it is the aqua vitae. Yeah. There is no past, there is no future, there is only now and whiskey. I mean, yeah. <laughs> like a, ooh, you, should a bit the, you should go into marketing, I swear. <laughs> <laughs> um, I haven't been up to much. My work had a really large inspection. I was stressed, now I'm not. I've been drinking a lot. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, so this, this is... <laughs> This, this is the, the let's go <laughs> come on let's run this off quick this is this is the yearly inspection just to make sure all your red pens are code compliant right yes yes I didn't get that the first time you said it <laughs> <laughs> uh, you know I was I was tr- attempted to use bureaucratic language for a bureaucratic exercise oh, fine 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 can you hear the topics being cut yep. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Okay, cool. So, how's 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 that been for you, Johnny? Is there anything else happened? <laughs> Come on, let's, uh, let's fucking fill this shit out. I read, let's go. Let's I, go. I read an Ursula Le Guin, Ursula Le Guin book, my first one. She's an author, and then I recommended she, she it does to the Luke. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, she does. She does the Earthsea Quartet. Damn and other, yeah. other hits. Correct. Yes, yes. and well, I read the first one. Called well, the well done on that bit of knowledge, Johnny. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, yeah. yeah. Oh, actually, you introduced me to. <laughs> yes, and I said you should really read it because it's really, really good. Yeah, I've got I've got one of the books now, but I haven't started reading it yet. It's really, really good. It's kind of weird that for somebody who's like a champion 
champion fantasy feminist, it's a really like traditional story with the women all in like villagey positions and the men all doing the heroing. I mean, you, 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 I mean, everyone starts off writing within the framework they know, right? Or every, everyone writes and within the framework. She kind of made it up like thirty years later when she wrote a short story about a utopia where everything's run by women and the men are just like fit and they play football and they're sex slaves for the women and they're totally happy about I mean, it. It sounds pretty fucking sounds pretty sweet. Good. Yeah, yeah, like, yeah, yeah, can we do that now? Um, we have put, to be really good at sports. Put it, put it forward to Jeremy Hunt. Esports, <laughs> <laughs> mate. I, it's in her game. I, I will learn sword fighting. I'm a game. I'll, I'll learn. I'll learn me some fucking fencing to make this world happen. Okay. Same. I'll just buy a HTC Vive first to you know get used to it. <laughs> I'll just be a commentator. <laughs> I'll, I'll be. I'll, I'll be the world's premier uh, vibrator juggler. <laughs> Impressive. <laughs> that sounds like a great slur. You fucking dildo juggler. <laughs> <laughs> That'd be a great audio visual experience. Just like the lights go off. Oh, oh yeah, okay. Maybe think going in the dark a bit. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. It's like, it, is that basically like pre, pre post production on Star Wars? <laughs> 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 no, it's the footage the of just them with like the twelve foot long purple the, dildos. The new, it's just... the new blue band group with like dildos hitting on drums and there's paint coming off. <laughs> <laughs> pin, so, the ta- pin the tail on the flashlight. We could play that, I suppose. <laughs> <laughs> As, like, as they bounce the dildos off the drums, like the ball sack, they hold like extra paint so their blue man faces get painted over with these other splashes. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That'd be beautiful. Um, cool. Right. Anything so, else, John? Johnny? Uh, I don't know, mate. Oh, I, I, how did you, you set up the studio? <coughs> yeah, I, I think we were just I, about I, to I, finish that last time. Yeah, and I tinker from time Ooh. to time and record little That's bits, right. but I, I, I need to take some more time off work to properly get on, on with it. Basically, I just sit in there with these really good speakers and listen to other people's music mm. most of the time and go, that sounds really good. <laughs> and then I could do that if I wanted to. Yeah, yeah exactly. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. No, I mean, that, that's, that's kind of half the creative process, right? Uh, that, that's what I'm telling myself. Yeah. Um, <laughs> <laughs> the other half's getting drunk. Indeed. <laughs> Um, I also started and got bored of Neo. Do you know the game? N I O. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. The Dark Souls. Just not quite as good as Bloodborne, <laughs> unfortunately. Uh, and now I've just started Neo Kuni Two, and that's where we're at. Cool. Oh, what nice. 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 Neo Kuni Two. What's that? It's the like, one it's, after it's, Nino Kuni it's, One. It's, um, <laughs> I can't remember who they paired up with. It's not Platinum. It's, it's Studio yeah, Ghibli yeah, yeah. paired up with a. Um, uh, yeah, a, yeah, a, like a, a, a developer to make a game. Oh, so okay. imagine Studio Ghibli, the RPG. Oh, okay, that sounds really Japanese. Yeah, that sounds sick. I have to look into it. Yeah, it's really, yeah, yeah. It's really saccharine, but like wicked. And you've yeah. got a Welsh sidekick. Who's, oh, Welsh, really? Yeah, he's like this weird little floating pixie with a lantern through his nose, and he's obscenely Welsh. It, is, that a, <laughs> is that the game where like someone from our world is like a policeman yeah. with a gun in yes. a fantasy world? Yeah, right, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Ooh. This yeah. the, the knicker, it's like spicy, yeah. you don't, it's a bit you don't, warm, innit? You don't, yeah. you don't swallow it. Like the second it gets to like your uvula, it's already evaporated. Mm. <laughs> Give us two more sips, and we won't be able to say uvula. So. <laughs> You're on the the Maybe uvula. Maybe uvula won't be able to say uvula. <laughs> I think we'll be able to say uvula. Yo, Luke, what have you been up to, Pam? Uh, I say uvula lovelier than uvula. <laughs> do <laughs> I've, well honestly working mostly because uh, i'm moving to spain so i've been planning yeah that as well. boy so that would be good to get away from the city and mm-hmm. you know enjoy that's still of... away you go <laughs> <laughs> that's the way no <laughs> but yeah apart from that so i mean i've just been up. reading, reading a new book <laughs> called ego's the enemy Ooh. Um, Ego is the Enemy by Ryan Holiday. Uh, he's a, he used to be like the marketing director for American Appar- Apparel and like he blew up in the marketing scene, but he's got some quite good philosophies. He's sto- cool. stoic and yeah, his book on the Ego is quite good. He, he talks about, he gives loads of examples of people who, um, you know, just throughout history and how um, being humble and getting rid of your ego can really help you be successful in your life. Oh, nice. Okay, cool. Sounds pretty good. Is he really like confident and self assured about that? <laughs> <laughs> Very good. <laughs> so, Taryn, how's your back? My back from carrying the hosting role because I'm busy. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I, I think I think we've managed to fit that joke in some form in <laughs> every <laughs> one of the last five. Weeks. Yeah. Hell yeah! Okay, wicked. Cool. Anything else? You been uh, any any tunes to recommend? Any any, any other any other bits? Come on. I don't know. I've, I've been listening to a lot of <laughs> a lot of beat reggae or gay reggae, as me and Lois like <laughs> like to call it. Reggae. Reggae. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, reggae. But yeah, no, not not much. Just working twelve hours a day, pretty much. Well, sometimes. <laughs> Reggae or sub dub? <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah, Greg. What's going oh. on, fam? Oh, I should have really. 
pre-thought something to say. I didn't. <laughs> Mate, I do it. It's just, I, I have been doing this shit for like four years. Now, I started off really well. I've now gotten slack as shit. <laughs> Man, I, all I do is write down a list of video games and TV I've watched because that's the only time I remember what I'm doing. Yeah. <laughs> I, I Currently, in, in my role as producer, I'm spending a lot of time completely forgetting to harvest my workmates for topics. Yeah. <laughs> all right. So uh, probably since the last time that I was on, uh, which was sometime last year, I have completed a couple of tests. I've... Which I've passed, thankfully. Cool. Hey. You're in the clear. Good to hear. Yay me. Yeah. Um, and then... They came back negative. We're all good. <laughs> <laughs> and then, um, uh, actually, recently, on Thursday, I went to play ping pong with, my, with the other team leaders at work. Mm-hmm. They experienced a bit of the Greg weird. <laughs> Is that what you're calling your cock nowadays? <laughs> <laughs> Only every Easy second joke. Wednesday. <laughs> um, Just like your cock. Yeah. <laughs> But yeah, it was it was really fun. Like they had, it's called Bounce. It's in Old Street, and you go downstairs, and it's really, really like uh, Renaissance downstairs. All of okay. it's like old school tiles and mouldings, all that sort of stuff. They have a restaurant, they have a bar, and they've got like twenty ping pong tables. But they've got these a couple of special ping pong tables, right? <laughs> that have interactive um, projectors, so that you can play points. <laughs> And try to aim for like different squares and oh, things like cool. that. Those crazy cunts made wind jammers real life. <laughs> oh, shit. Yeah, it's absolutely mental. You lunatics! <laughs> it's fully interactive. Like cool. you're actually choosing which game with the ping pong ball and everything. Nice. Yeah. And then we got drunk. Yeah. No, that sounds about par for the course. <laughs> Anything else going? Are you reading good books recently? Um, Anything to recommend to our our good sweet endurers? Hello, endurers. By the way, hi. I, uh, I see you there. Looking ever so they don't durable. See us. <laughs> <laughs> well, I did. Um, I did start reading uh, like because I've had my like Patrick Rothfuss. Roth- Rothfuss. Rothfuss. Yeah, yeah. Rothfuss. Um, I've been waiting for his third book for such a long time, mate. Just fucking put it put it to the back of your mind. It will happen when it happens. Yeah, but every Meditate. now and then, just crops up and says, "Greg, I want to finish this." So I decided to work uh, to read this side book that he wrote. Oh fuck me! Yes, it's we're about so halfway good. through that, and I'm just like, this is this is really really creative writing. It is. Which one's yeah, that? It's uh, the slow regard of silent things. Cool. Yeah, um, lovely name. Ba- basically, it follows one of the characters and her world, it, and her and just kind of the way she interprets things. What's it's, her name? Uh, uh, Auri yeah. or Ori. Um, mm. It's it's kind of like. Um, so, you know, imagine if your uh, view of the world wasn't just kind of logical uh, uh, essentialism, but actually it was kind of you, you lived in poetry and interacted with things in a poetic way. This is this is like this book. It's fucking incredible. Yeah. It, it, so far, I'm like, it really like accentuates that there's a there's a line between um, crazy and um, eccentric. Mm. And it flirts with that line very, very, very well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, yeah, I, I've always enjoyed his writing, but I wanted he's, to he's bloody well write some more stuff. He's too busy with D&D, mate. Well, <laughs> just, like, pull your... Like other authors we know. <laughs> I, I mean, your staff out your ass. Have you looked at any in, uh, any interviews of his? Like, the reason it's taken so, so, uh, so long is because he worked to a deadline on the second book, and it almost, like, the pressure of that almost ended his marriage and fucked things up. So this time he's just gone, do you know what? It's going to be done when it's done. I don't Which, care. I don't yeah, care. Respectable. Oh, you should. <laughs> you should. You want. You should. You should want the best from your artists. I do. But I still but want to read it now. Your artists, <laughs> no, not from your artists. Yeah, but that's like to get the best from is they they get what's best for. Yeah, but it's been nine years. Yeah. Like surely he's repaired his marriage by now. <laughs> Oh, sick! Oh, wait, if you want to read more Patrick Rothfuss, he's done a um, he's done a, a, a comic run uh, with a crossover between Rick and Morty and Dungeons and Dragons. Mm-hmm. Mm. Um, he, and he does bits of writing elsewhere. So just like dig a little deeper. Like he'll, he'll get back to it. Don't you worry. Yeah, I just it's such a impatient. It's, I know. I hear you. So good. It really is. I, do you know what? Okay, let's as, as we're on books, I'll talk about. Uh, so the past two weeks, I have been reading the latest in the laundry files, the Labyrinth mm-hmm. Index, maybe. Uh, yeah, yeah, I think yeah, yeah. that's what it looks like. Yeah, 
That's oh god. Oh, just fucking Tom. Have you bought this shit on your A? Right, I need the, my copy of the full amount. Yeah, no, I saw it on my shelf yesterday because I've got. All of them, it's apart nice from book collection. number three now, yeah. and it's oh, it's it's annoying. It's <laughs> it's fucking annoying. Um, but also buy that shit on Kindle already. Yeah. Get it read. Get it done. I need to talk to someone about this shit. Oh my fuck! Just uh, do you, know do you know what's even more annoying is the is, fact that I pulled it off my shelf the other day. Cause I see, I could see a bookmark poking out, and it's like over three quarters of the way through the book. Oh, man. <laughs> so I, really I can't believe not. you stopped just as shit was about to kick <laughs> off. <laughs> oh. I'm just going to lord it over him for years. So, I mean, that, that's been pretty cool. Uh, just reading that, that's, that's been keeping... I don't know, it's been a real kind of... Do you know, like, do you ever go through those weeks where it's just like the entire world seems to have managed to worm its way into your bones and the air around you has turned into soup and your, and your brain's turned to pudding? Summer. And, yeah, well, I, mean, yeah, I suppose it might have been. Um, it's, it's been. It's been one of those, but like, yeah, reading uh, the new laundry files has been has been great fun. Well, are you referencing the fact that it's so muggy outside, or are you referencing the consistent amount of existential dread? Muggy? Uh, no, I mean it's just 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 having a difficult week. Okay, I suppose yeah, is, is, is what I was going for. Um, which oh, is talk, well, talking about it maybe a little too floridly. Yeah, well, in that case, say. let's get drunk. You? Let's get drunk. Uh, I popped down to Hastings for birthday for Darren's uh, girlfriend. Oh, it was lovely to see people be silly, get mm-hmm. messy, good, good, plenty smash. I, I feel like there's not been... I've, oh, yeah, I mean, I've got a, a, a book. That's what I did the other day. What's so that? I have a new bookcase. Yes. When I pulled the other bookcases out, uh, that were there, the small ones, I realised that in getting a full and then fully loaded bookcase, not quite fully loaded yet, I've got, I've got the shelves space again, guys. <laughs> oh! But in, in putting that there, I'm going to lose access completely to four outlets. So uh, on right. Thursday, um, I, like, I realised what I wanted was like two one metres, so I can have outlets at the bottom, and then two two metres, so I can have outlets up high for, like, lamps or whatever. Okay. Um, But apparently, you don't get one metre and two metre 13 amp extension cords anywhere with any sort of regularity. So I spent Thursday fucking making them. Which yeah, was, say, it's not hard. <laughs> yeah, it was, it's really not. I, I was, it was really nice and good and fun, and I enjoyed awesome. it. So I, I, I did some work and stuff. So there's been that. <laughs> Uh, trying to think. Oh, it's really, it's just been a slow kind of work. It's been work, and I've done work, and mm-hmm. that's... How's how's your work, Tom? Is your work kind of worky? Yeah, it's really worky. <laughs> it's, what, do you, what do you call it? My Anyone quirky? else? My boss has is gone on holiday. also worky? Please worky write in. Would, yeah. <laughs> would, would you describe it as quirky work? work is your work? No. Uh, hurty work? Yeah. Oh, damn. Flatty oh. work. <laughs> oh well, you are you are in the uh, in the bar business. Yeah, I've been hiding out at meetings and in the kitchen, and <laughs> I've been Tom, doing very little on the floor. You're a stripper, I didn't know. Yeah, hell yeah, baby. <laughs> have you I, have not, to, I have to come watch you sometime. I don't like people watching. I'm, I'm that kind of stripper. That, no, turn around, <laughs> nobody look look. the other way, and I'll just waggle it behind you. T- turn back, you're just completely. You feel naked. that breeze across your neck, sir. Schrodinger's <laughs> stripper. I like it. <laughs> I mean, he so like Tom. Tom when he dances, he wears a headband so that when he goes around the spin pole, you can just slip like dollar bills into his in, in, onto his forehead as he <laughs> kind of rotates around the pole. <laughs> progressively getting sweaty and sweaty. Like, and like, a, sh- <laughs> like a sushi meal, like, re- really up in that yeah. forehead game. Yeah, like, <laughs> like a sushi, like, like the stripper version of Yo Sushi. Yeah, yes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Only okay, Tom don't give you fish. Tom give you beef. <laughs> <laughs> what I give you? Kobe. <laughs> Sausage. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, is anyone like... Any- no, literally you took my one thing, which was going for Hazel's birthday. I, yeah. I watched Good Omens. It's oh, much, yeah, that was it's really better good. than the book. Yeah. Is it oh, really? You are yeah, that was the good. only person I've heard to say that. Oh, it's just because it, the like actors it. actually... Like, do a lot of the lifting on that. I the have... two main c- characters are played really well, aren't they? Yes. As I understand, but the mm, rest are kind absolutely. of flat. <sighs> I don't know, I'm, I'm going yeah, to get around to watching flat. it at some point, but everything I've seen of it so far, I've I've seen David Tennant and Michael Sheen in their roles and just gone, do you know what, ten years ago, this would have been <laughs> done amazingly by Rick Mayle and Aid Edmondson. <laughs> oh, shit, that's a shout. Right? Yeah, yeah. That would have been incredible. Yeah. Yeah, but we didn't have the production design back then. 
Oh, oh, I, but I, still, I, even if it was done on a shoestring budget, them two would have been funny. Uh, yeah, it would have carried the whole fucking thing by yeah. itself. And at that time, you probably could have got Nicholas Holt to play the um, the, the Devil Child, which would have been pretty good as well. <laughs> yeah, it's a good shout. Okay, um, you hear me, Hollywood? Fucking come get your casting, boy. I'll cast you up real good. I'll cast you for real. Is that like the Hollywood version of a fluffer? That's a fixer. Oh, and also a fluffer. A fluxer. <laughs> Should we do a fucking show? Yeah, go on mm. then. <laughs> Where are we starting? <sighs> Host pot with... It's all, it's all next to you, dude. So who haven't we had in a while? Well, mm. these two. Well, these I, th- I, think, I think we haven't had Greg in the longest. So let's start with uh, with Greg. Greg Gets one from Il Hotty de la Bozzi. One from the hosts. This is a Gregorian chanting there for you. We're just practicing our quartets with one spare me. <laughs> uh, the G, always got to have a spare me. Yeah. Uh, so this is from Heath. All Hello. right. One from Heather. If you were a chair, what type would you be? So you know, I those... decline to answer. <laughs> oh, oh. oh God. I'm gonna deck you. Yeah. <laughs> oh my God. Deck chair. <laughs> That's what I was going for. Heck yeah. <laughs> just give, give me like just, just just work it into a sentence a bit better first. Just cushion the blow. Before, before that shit happens. <laughs> I've no mode straight away. Lazy boy. I, so, do you know, you know... Just so those... I can make it into a basketball. Yeah, fair dues. Nice. Um, you know that you know those camp chairs that look re- like fold out camp chairs. They're kind of <laughs> move, ducky, move around. <laughs> like they, they seem really utilitarian and they seem really comfortable until you get to the point of use. Yeah, and you end up skewing, you skewering your leg. But yeah, you know, important. It's one of those fold-up ones with like the two beer holders, but it's kind of, kind of got that crossbar at the front, so your thighs are never quite comfortable. Mm-hmm. Uh, however, you sit. I think that's probably that's probably Johnny. Oh. Now, <laughs> I joke. I joke. That's me. That's that's me through and through. No, Johnny's a crotch rocket. I know not what. You don't worry about it. <laughs> I, I, I I pictured Johnny as a cajon. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. nice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just I, I full of music. A con with a cushion, uh, with a cushion on it. Yeah. yeah. Wait, is a con the one <laughs> with the classic scene where the guy's sitting in the chair in front of a speaker and the? And then the con, con's the drum box that you sit on and. Uh, see, I don't mm. know much about chairs. <laughs> I, t- I mean, technically, <laughs> needs this Johnny. It's an instrument. <laughs> <laughs> you don't I, know much about chairs. No. Which is a shame because you would be a fine ass Chippendale, sir. Let me tell you. <laughs> I don't know what that means. <laughs> Actually, I want to change my. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Where's the follow up? I, I've got, I, I've got I want to change, no, change my okay. type of chair. I reckon I'm a rocking chair. Okay. Very good. Because if you rock too quickly, you would just end up confused. <laughs> mm. And it's the same with me. If you talk to me too long, you just end up confused what's going on. Mate, you're a fucking <laughs> Queen Anne. Someone's re upholstered in like coral pink. <sighs> Oh, sir. <laughs> Fucking chair-based insults. Let's do this shit. I'd be a gaming chair, just to esports and that. So. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, go for that one. I'll, I'll be a beanbag. You know, you overuse me and I explode. <laughs> uh, or or, or perhaps you'd be like, like one of those moon chairs, but instead of spinning like uh, 360, the, <laughs> the bit it moves on is a spine up the back, so you sit on it and then it just rolls you backwards and flips you off. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that's how that works. Yeah, that's oh, somehow. Has anyone tried those? Those? Uh, it's like an egg, and on the inside, it's got a wheel, and you just keep turning the wheel as fast as you can. You keep spinning as fast and fast and right. Fast yeah, as yeah, as yeah. Can. Oh, yeah. But like teacups. Yeah. Yeah, 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 like that. Except you're stuck in an enclosed space okay. with people that are also sweating. Okay. Mm. I reckon I'm one of those. Are there then. any lights? You reckon uh, you're one of those? Yeah. It's just full of sweaty people. Of, <laughs> Mate, I can, I can respect that. Sex work is work. Uh, hey. Right? That's... <laughs> God, really. Going down that, that. <laughs> going down that mine. <laughs> Got to make oh that paper. Oh, my God. Do you, do you, you guys remember the beginning of the Holy Grail with the kind of frenetic music and the flashing orange? Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Right? I'd like it if when you span that egg thing, that's what played. And it would go as fast as you span. <laughs> what, like Willy Wonka going Yeah. Because yeah. you know it winds up a lot of sound. So I'd like to hear it like... <laughs> the ball will sort of fall apart as you get faster and you're just flying through space. So have you ever seen one of those seats that's like, it's kind of the centre of a gyroscope? 
Yeah. So it's it's a chair, yeah. but then it kind of it's it's Ooh, okay, yeah. yeah, it's in a gyroscope, mm. so it moves with uh, three axes of movement. Yeah, and it just fucking fun. spin it. Oh, Have yeah, you been the in training? One? Yeah. Uh, okay, so they, my they question. They had one at fairgrounds, and they had one at Glastonbury for God's yeah, sake. My it question really is, who would be that costs. that gyroscope chair? Not necessarily here. Like who? Like who did that make you think of as a person? Riyad. Chris. <laughs> oh. Ooh. Ooh. I was going to say Chris Duckers. That's what I thought originally as well, but I thought Riyadh would be more appropriate. But it's just who makes me want to puke. Taron! Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> um, I, I would like to vote for... Um... I don't know that many chairs. Oh, what about the chair from Bedknob and Broomsticks? Who would be that? The, what's the chair for? Oh bed no, room? it's a bed. It's a bed, hence the title. <laughs> okay, I know. What, I know I <laughs> it's guess, the titular bed. <laughs> yeah. I would like I to know. be the sofa from Harry Enfield and Chubbs, like the really large one that makes Lulu and and whatever his oh, face look, yeah. look, look small. <laughs> oh right, okay, that's a good shout. Do you know what would actually be be a reasonably um, good description? Of, have you guys seen that video clip of that guy <laughs> that has turned um, a a recliner into like a? It's got like a motor and everything, and he just takes it down to the. Oh yeah, um, what's his name? Furs. It's got one. The Colin YouTube. Furs. Yeah. Yeah, it's oh, like what, a motorized, the, like, motorized couch. Yeah. yeah, like a motorized oh, couch. Yeah, yeah. Or, yeah, that's probably um, probably me actually. I'm what, so lazy that I just want to drive. What it about the casting couch? Who would that be? <laughs> uh, pro- that's, pro- that's the dream couch, right? Probably. Um, <laughs> shit, what's his name? Uh, fucking. A uh, hairy comedian wears tight trousers. Russell something. Russell Brand. Russell Brand. I think. I think. I think <laughs> Russell Brand couch. is the, cou- the casting couch. When you think comedian, for some reason, Bill say... Bailey came to mind. I was, like, <laughs> <laughs> I was like, my god, Ross Noble came to mind for me. Ross that's Noble, probably even worse. <laughs> <laughs> Are you sure? No, like fucking. Uh, Bill Bailey is is some kind of fucking Chesterfield wingbacks monstrosity with scroll work on the feet. That kind of shit. <laughs> yeah. I think if you're going to do the, um, but also cough. squeaks like the the, the, the springs <laughs> squeak like a fart every time you sit down. On it. God. Oh, oh, funny. Musically, musically fast. Though. Yeah, yeah, like to a tune. <laughs> I, that wasn't the the, the was... encounter thing. That was just some noise. <laughs> oh god, I, that is now on my bucket list though. Managed to do a fart in tune of Close Encounters. <laughs> <laughs> Wow, it's it's difficult to make notes with your face farts. <laughs> um, I think if you're going to do casting couch, you're going to have to go for with Weinstein, though. Oh, oh shit. that's made it seedy, right? No, 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 it's, no, it's no, got to be seedy. Yeah. No, 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 no. I can't, I can't. Taking something because, so innocent, no, and just twisted it. It's, it's, it's not Weinstein. It's not Weinstein. It's Weinstein purely for the fact that <laughs> right, everybody who gets fucked on that couch agreed to it. Oh, that's true. Yeah, yeah. That is one of my favourite memes, though, is that photo of someone, one of the girls sat on the casting couch and it's just like, my girlfriend's gone for an interview today. I hope she gets it. Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> she failed. <laughs> well, she did get it. Indeed. Cool. Uh, Can I just right. take a quick second to say well done on the whiskey? Mm. Oh, How my word, yeah. yeah no, the burn's so gone now, isn't it? It's yeah. just like uh, sipping whiskey now. Yeah, now, now that I've passed that the first, shit, like... It's, it's now just like drinking mm. silky air. Mm. Mm. The, fir- the first sip <laughs> was... It's like, like, it's like liquid air. incense. It's wonderful. Yeah. Liquid, yes. <laughs> Better than liquid incest, that's for sure. <laughs> liquid incest? Is that like a new know. genre? <laughs> Do you listen to liquid incest? Oh, yeah. Oh, that, that, oh yes. I've always forgotten. The, the joke from that, that jo- joke from last night was like, Oh, hello, brother. I'm going to have sex with you now. Oh, well, if you incest. Yes. <laughs> Johnny, would, Brilliant. Uh, would you care to get one from uh, the community chest, from Sophie's chest? El Communitas. Oh. One from the Endurers. This be from a record. Record. Also, thank you for sending in loads of topics. Oh, this yes. Week. Th- thank you, everyone. And yeah. Let's see how long we can go with this. Slarty Bartfast is a nice name. Slarty Bartfast is a nice Like, like talk, talking about cadence. E- even, like, if you look at it, Feel it like it. It feels like it should be a horrible word, but it it's it's so nice to say. Britain, it feels like to me like a word that keeps starting again. Like slarty, yeah. and then and then bar, bar and then bar, 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 and you're like cadence. Yeah. <laughs> slarty bar, <bar-bars. laughs> wouldn't be that great, Britain. It's like, also quite close to uh, fuck fast. 
Yes, I can. Sorry, having cadence is the first slarty name of that. Fast. <laughs> cadence, slarty bart fast. Ooh. Ooh. Well, yeah, yeah, it's slarty bart fast. That's a better No, all right, cadence, slarty buck fast. Slarty slart fast. That's a great point. Slarty fast, Steve Blart start. Helston Poles, we can do this all day. Uh, no, I, I agree. Like, Sl- Slightly Bart Fast is a, is a very good... Because uh, yeah, it's kind of, Yes, it's got that quality of like feeling like it's starting again and again. The cadence is nice. It just it does just kind of just it's, tumble off your tongue. I can mean... It's imagine... like a velvet lawnmower. Like you're trying to start it. And it's just... Uh, <laughs> like, we... <laughs> the, the immediate, um, the immediate velvet image that comes to my mind is the name of a stripper boat. A stripper Ooh. boat. Yeah. That's a new I was novel the, concept. I was me. thinking of Terry Pratchett character. Slightly Bart Fast. Yeah, okay. I mean... Yeah. It, no, it's a it's it's Douglas Adams. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It, it could be um, an entry in uh, Viz's uh, Profanosaurus. <laughs> Absolute slarty bart Slarty bart farce is when you do a fart so hard you fill your, ch- your socks in like 30 <laughs> seconds. <laughs> I feel like it's the entry in Nikola Tesla's diary that one time he tried oh, that. Oh, man, that was very discreet. <laughs> oh, it's like, oh, that was a hell of slarty a Slarty bart, bart farce. Mate, it was a sock filler. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> Better put your suspenders on because you're in for a slarty bar fast. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> that, that, so, so, so a nice name. Quick, get the yeah, soda. Nice yeah. Yeah. Quick, nice get the so, soda panels. This is going to be one head of a slarty bar fast. <laughs> what does that even mean exactly? <laughs> this entire conversation reminds me of a story. So, <laughs> I thought you were just going to go Amazing. Cool. silent. Right. Yeah, no, like a month ago... Let's talk about stories now. Yeah. A month ago, I was talking to my dad on Skype. I do it every second week, just to keep in on contact with my family. Yeah, on a Wednesday. Okay. Um, and we Reference. just somehow... I'd like, I'd, I may have like smoked a J before talking to my dad. It was a terrible idea. The, this was, of course, many years ago that in no way relates to you right now. Yes, no. exactly. Yeah. And um, not him. Yeah, yeah, his, yeah, his mate yeah. him. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So, so this, is, evil this is a story about Bill Vallow. Yeah, okay. yeah, yeah. Uh, so, <laughs> oh. so I'm there talking to my dad. And I'm like, oh, dad, what's going on? And he's like, well, I've had these problems for the last week, which is every time I fart, I'm scared that it, I've, I've shit my pants. <laughs> How okay. do you how do you offer Co- this like, is, no, condolences? This is, and, this is and the job for the right. courtesy wank. Uh, courtesy wank. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> what? I'm so shit. sorry. Right. <laughs> oh At least God! Turn my, the camera my, off. My and lost on that one time for a wank. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not gonna look at it yet. Oh, it's squiddy, or is it? Is it just? Is that a slarty bar fast? Now tell me it's a slarty bar fast. <laughs> Shock filler. <laughs> uh, yeah. So. <laughs> this this came about by I was also, like, oh, have you been Anthony out? Kiedis. Sorry, <laughs> so, what sock fella? Yeah. <laughs> like, this came about on on the question of, oh, have you been out? Have you been doing anything? Because he's retired, and he's like, no, I, I'm I'm afraid to leave the house, and that's why it came to the like the whole like thinking that he should be pants instead of farting. So I introduced him to the word of shart. <laughs> oh, okay. Okay. And then we uh, basically but not- had to end the call because we could not stop laughing. Ah, oh, shouty bart cute. fast. <laughs> I mean, so so Greg, I th- I'm I'm so you introduce him to the word sharp, which just gives a name to the problem. It doesn't actually provide any solutions. Like you could have introduced him to the word butt plug. Knowing you have a problem <laughs> and knowing its name is half the battle. It is half the battle. Knowing the solution though, yeah, but no, that's quite the opposite. Golden. You name it, that, you make that's it not real. The solution, that, that makes it. That brings it. That engenders it. In Stop the world, that. In the world of magic, you take power from it. <laughs> Yeah, it's not the solution. No. You, Mate, take power you don't want to put charts. magic near his asshole. <laughs> that's not a good idea. Is that what you're calling your penis nowadays? <laughs> that's, that's Bring dark. in the magic. That's casting a spell. That's dark alchemy. <laughs> Greg, Debbie I, McGee giving your hand. Greg, it is, it is a solution. In fact, like oh, not take, take his it, issue. Take, not take, his it, issue. take it from someone who knows. It's, it's very difficult to fart while you're wearing a butt plug. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I get your point. But also, with my dad's medical condition, it wouldn't work. Well, does, does he not have an ass? <laughs> <laughs> no, he's been in hospital with kidney failure, and some all the drugs that he gave him has made him basically to the point where he can't stop shitting. Ooh! Ooh. Okay. But then the other side of things, if if it like if he doesn't shit, then it becomes explosive, <laughs> <laughs> weaponized. So if I mean, you put I mean, a blood plug up there, somebody could lose an eye. Oh, God. I'm going to have to change that album art, aren't I? <laughs> I'm just going to have a picture of Greg's dad bent over shooting a butt plug out of full torrent. Yeah, <laughs> so I was trying to catch it in a pair of herbs. The, 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 album art, 
<laughs> the album art absolutely should be joking about renal failure. Yeah. Okay, yeah, let's do this. <laughs> um, yeah, okay, fair enough. Like, given given the fuller context, that's sure. I mean, but okay, so I know, I know it has a stigma, but. If you get to that point, do you not just get like a colostomy attached and then never have to bother about shitting again? No, you can't. He's got diabetes. Wait, oh. could you not have a colostomy bag if you've got diabetes? You don't heal fast enough. Can you do it as okay. an elective surgery? <laughs> so it'd just be funny. <laughs> just like you know, like trucker bombs, like peeing yeah, in a yeah. bottle. And, can you imagine that? <laughs> oh, I mean, it would just actually just choosing to go go, go, yeah. go full colostomy. Yeah, yeah, uh, yeah. Especially because if it's elective, like, you don't actually need it. Then go there's, there's, full colostomy. The, 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 yeah, you, you can just turn, never go turn full it off. Yeah, just turn it off. Yeah, if you want a normal poo. Yeah, just, just turn off the valve. Yeah. Uh, lock it. Get rid of the bag. Save the ammo just, for later. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Make sure to leave it behind Hannah Beth's toilet, and away you go. <laughs> just, just smear it and, like, <coughs> pry back a floorboard, put it under there, slice it open, <laughs> shut the floorboard. Yeah, board, take, take some back. acid, get some hardboard, like, cut it open, <laughs> do, do, like, acrylic pour style. Onto the hard stop <laughs> colostomy bag. It's my favourite martial art. <laughs> that is slarty bar fast. That's, 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 that's doing just, a slarty bar fast. That is a very slarty bar fast right there. <laughs> An arty bar from arty uh, bar fast. <laughs> oh god, Neil Buchanan's now <laughs> presenting this. It's, yeah, it's going to be. It's the name of the next album from his uh, glam rock band, hair metal band, rather. <laughs> Uh, all right, cool. Yes, <laughs> Let me, I, Tom and I were having fun, but you guys were all silent. So uh, I'll. Uh, I'll I'm I'll, sorry. Did I go whimsy for once? All right, fuck you. All. <laughs> I, I, I was loving it. Yeah. Uh, okay, we got. Oh, this is this is yellow. This is legal paper one from the host. It's one from me. Turn on. <sighs> okay. Uh, the worst thing to smell on your fingers after touching your dick. <laughs> oh my god. Your sister? <laughs> oh. <coughs> Not in all okay, cases. Okay, so, 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 <laughs> well, so obviously, worse than that is your grandma. I mean, I so she I died last year. Like <laughs> <laughs> that's even worse. So I mean, both of these like come loaded with story because if I'm loaded, because <laughs> <yeah>, <laughs> if you can smell, if you can smell your fingers and know, oh, that smells like my sister or that smells like my grandma, that means you already know. What your t- like? What those family members smell like yeah, in relation to your You've only just dick. now started to feel bad about it. That's, well, that's, that's some... and yeah. if, if you're putting your penis somewhere where their general nether regions are, I think you might know what it smells like, unless you're wearing a peg during. Oh, hang on. <laughs> I think I just found my fetish. But, 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 <laughs> but assumedly, if you've gone in and you discovered that already, like it's not going to be the worst thing. You've already kind of you've committed to the bit, right? It's like okay, cool. We're, I, 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 mate, mate, we've, I, we've, we've all been that drunk and not remembered fucking our sisters. <laughs> <laughs> I say, I say, chili honest, sauce. Chili sauce is probably the worst, right? Just like, oh god, because you know what's about oh, to come. Good answer, <laughs> sir. <laughs> Get ready for the burn. Yeah, what's about to come is certainly like, not you. Unless the, you're into that, of it's course. Like, what not, the like, fuck is that? Oh, no. <laughs> that is a good fucking answer. Um, I mean, I would... Uh, what would I hate to smell on my hands <laughs> after touching my dick? Blue cheese. <laughs> mm. Depends where you put it. You can have one of those towels. Smear it on some toast. You'll be all right. <laughs> Recycling. <laughs> so... Oh, Gotta think of Mother Earth. <laughs> it's the only way I can get hard. <laughs> oh, back to the trees, guy. Uh. <laughs> I hardly. <laughs> so yeah, along, okay. I mean, there, all right. Well, there's a bit of a walk of this one. Okay, and get I, ready. I, Put I'm, those walkie boots on, everyone. Not, not even sure Strap it's going to be funny. I'm pretty sure it's just going to be like uh, horrifying. But <laughs> <laughs> so, um, so going back to this uh, this idea of like uh, you waking up and then finding you've done. Finding out that your dick smells not like it should and not remembering what's going on. Mm-hmm. So imagine, if you will, a situation where you, uh, you wake up and you turn on the television and um, like you don't re- really remember much of the night before. You remember some of the early night, but you don't remember much of it. And then there's a news report. It's like, oh, this person was found murdered. And they show a picture of them. You go, oh, I remember them. They smell really nice. And then about 20 minutes later when you go for a repeat. Oh, my God. You come back and you know, your hand smells exactly like you remember them smelling. I think that <laughs> so would. This is like that the, would be the I, pe- I, the pe- like the the phallic equivalent of visions. The Haken album <laughs> <laughs> mixed a bit mi- mixed a bit with Memento, I suppose. Yeah, like I, I, was, I was thinking yeah, yeah, more yeah, Memento, yeah. but yeah, visions is good. <laughs> <laughs> the 
Dalek versions of Aiken's <laughs> visions. <laughs> I was a, I was a, do you know what? Out of all of our Enduros, that one was just for you. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> I don't think anyone else is going to get that. Yo, what's up? <laughs> <laughs> that was absolutely not for anybody else but us. That was good. <laughs> was that like parodies? Is that what you were Has, has anyone else got anything else, uh, anything else to go on uh, with, like, worst thing to spend on your dick after touching it? I still think Jimmy. I'm trying. I'm trying to think. Uh, like, what's, what are the worst smells? Shed. Oh, <laughs> shed. oh dear God! You know something's gone wrong. <laughs> if your, if dick your dick smells, smells like, like shed, the Pokeball you, you, shed. Yeah, the Jock Shop Studios. Yeah, last that time was. I, a... Last time I impregnated a shed was the worst day of my life. Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it was just. Oh man. Yeah. No. Touching your dick and then having it come back smelling of black mold. That would be... Oh, my God. Asbestos? Oh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and is that, is that, is that We can keep going is that, that way. grave soil? What's going on? <laughs> I'm still can't, trying to come up with a fucking shed pun. God damn it, keep going. <laughs> I know, right? I can see your... <laughs> Oh, like, oh, 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 oh. <laughs> can, can you imagine going for a pee and then having yourself going, oh, that smells like how Boris Johnson looks like he smells. <laughs> <laughs> now all I imagined was... It smells like Theresa May's promises. <laughs> when your peen smells like the PM, yeah. <laughs> oh, but your only response to the whole thing is, that must have been a fucking wicked night last night. <laughs> yeah, what do you think Jeremy Hunt smells like? A cunt. <laughs> no, because I quite no, like that smell. Yeah, I quite like that smell. Don't ruin cunts for me. And, and, and unless you're going for the figurative, not not literal no. cunt. Like if you're going figurative, fig, 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 yeah. figurative, like what? Like you're talking? Maybe he smells like blue jeans, man. He smells like. Does does, does evasion have a maybe smell? Maybe he smells like jupe. Sure. He smells like the accumulation. <laughs> he smells like jupe, doesn't he? He's, Motherfucker smells he like jupe. Smells jupe. like the boots. Perfume section, <laughs> just a mishmash of all of it. He smells like the accumulation he, of every he, he, guy, he guy smells... and Jeremy Kyle. He smells like the. I bet he smells like the high end version um, aftershave that Dupe is ripping off. Only too much of it. That's what I reckon Jeremy Hunt smells like. <laughs> Lynx Africa. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my mate the other day just said, "Oh, like I don't, I don't know why there's such this this such a stigma against Lynx Africa." Like, because it. I like, like it. It's you not can't good. Like, it's not no, good. it doesn't. It smells it like. Smells Bad. It, it smells, smells like '90s jungle to me. <laughs> it really does. Hanging out in teenage yeah, kids. I like '90s bedroom. jungle. <laughs> yeah, no, totally. But every time I smell it, I think I go back there. <laughs> hmm. I go go back to the place. Yeah. PTSD. The back of a General Levi place. in the trees. General Levi in the trees. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, fucking hell. So today I told one of the guys at work to bring in the blackboard painting and put a message on it. And he wrote back, can I please write on it? Incredible sun, incredible food, incredible um, drink, incredible General Levi. Oh, <laughs> no. Nice. I just sent back, as long as you put the bottom, su 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 sensational. No. <laughs> so hopefully when I get back to work tomorrow, that's on there. Cool, cool, cool. <laughs> uh, any other... Ventures into uh, the world of what your dick would be bad to smell of on your hands that you just touched with. <laughs> <laughs> Can you smell? Oh, this, oh, this, this is, this, <laughs> I was just going to say this, is, this, this is what happens when lots of coffee clashes with um with, with fifty fifty uh, percent whiskey. <laughs> yeah. Uh, no. All right. Fuck it. Let's do something else. All right, cool. What we got? Uh, Tom, I believe it's one from uh, El Comunite. Uh, you can get your topics read out on air by sending them to emails at pottopicpodcast.com or going to the website, yeah, preferably, you, like, and you, clicking on Submit Topic. Always remember, Injurers, you, you miss every shot you don't take, so send something to uh, the, the Pot Topic Podcast. Including God, shots. That's, that chest definitely still smells like that, shed. That, would you, shed would that's would a you, pure would shed. You, would that you smells your like dick your dick, like that, that does. Yeah. <laughs> that is. Yeah, but it's like leather and shed. Oh, is anyone else getting <laughs> nostalgic like, for the smell of shed? Wait, wait, right, no. It's 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 the same. It's, it's, it smells like leather and shed. It smells yeah. like a shed daddy. Yeah. Like two sniff on. <laughs> that's what they'll call Luke after he fucks the shed. <laughs> Two sniff past. Two sniff past. Oh. <laughs> well, somebody's got to procreate with him. That's how little sheds are born. <laughs> <laughs> I just work at Alfred's. What, what we got, Tom? We have another one from Rickard. Thank you, Sophie's mm -hmm. chest. Uh, oh, I think we're all going to answer the same way, but 
GIF or GIF? It's a GIF. 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 Sif. Uh, <laughs> bang. GIF. <laughs> well, they renamed it years ago. Like, they took the European name. It's, it's Sif. Sif. Oh, oh he means off. the fucking bathroom I know, cleaner. I know. Yeah, oh, that took me yeah. way too long. No, I don't. I mean the fucking like, little si- short internet animations. Sif. <laughs> No, those are Use the bad it. guys in Star Wars. I will end you. <laughs> <laughs> and then, and then, like once once you watch your once you watch your Sith, you then just dash your laptop at your bath, smash it to pieces, and then use that to clean all the grime off, right? Bang bang. Boy, uh... no. <laughs> <laughs> Swing and a miss. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know what? Fuck you guys. <laughs> All right, Wait, fine. Let's talk about GIF or GIF. I think we I think got we more did. out of Swati Bart fast, to be fair. And then, like, this is... G- it's, 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 it's GIF. It's, yeah, yeah, GIF. Even though I don't give a fuck that the inventor <laughs> said, oh, yeah, no, this is how she pronounced GIF. I mean, go fuck yourself, man. Like, you created a format. You didn't create the name. You don't create the language. Go fuck off. But I feel people, that way. People rule that shit, yeah? Yeah. I feel you, that next, way you, next, next you're going to be telling me that it, it, it's pronounced yate, not yeet. Do your own dick. <laughs> Suck your mum. <laughs> <laughs> Interestingly enough, um, Sif in Australia is GIF. <laughs> really? Sorry? Yeah. That so is in Sif Cleaner. Sif Cleaner is GIF Cleaner <laughs> in Australia. Well, it's spelled with a G. No, it's J. <laughs> but that's GIF. Yeah, GIF. <laughs> but, but that's not GIF. GIF. Yeah, but because I've got an Australian accent, it sounds the same. Gif. No, it doesn't. <laughs> that's that's a bit key. Gif. <laughs> gif. That was, that was gif. more more sapper, My name is I Gif. <laughs> what? No, gif, gif and Gif. Oh, it doesn't matter. The like, that's what. When? Sure. <laughs> <laughs> All right. What? When? Sure. Right. Let's go. Cool. That that was wicked. <laughs> Ish. <laughs> Rickard. <You're> okay. <laughs> well done. Send me a topic. I, mean, I hope you got an answer. Like, do you know what, Rickard? Um. We'll, we'll actually take time out of our days to read any email you send to us. So, like, write back to us and talk to us about <laughs> um, how you pronounce it, what led to you asking that question, and like, sort of break it down etymologically. And also, like, how does it vary no, the, for, the, for let, the Swiss? Let, let's be honest. I put on the Discord chat, I've got 45 minutes until I need to print off topics, sending you topics. I think Boyd done good. Oh, okay. <laughs> he, he sent in a fair few. <laughs> right, what we got? Oh my god. <laughs> it's from Tom. Uh oh. You are a TV producer and you get to create a show starring a celebrity. What? What is it who stars? What? Oh, it's okay. All caps, man. That ain't too bad. <laughs> what is it who stars? Mine, in, mine is Show Me, Show Me, Show Me. How do you do that trick starring Robert Smith where you have to show him a magic trick three times to win a speedboat or something? Show me, show me, show me! How oh. you do that trick? It's the start of Just Like Heaven, sorry. Right, yeah, yeah, fair dues. I want, I want to see a TV show where Brian Blessed goes and shouts at those protesters outside that school in Birmingham where they tried to stop people teaching people about same-sex marriage and stuff. Just <laughs> Brian Blessed, like, laying into them and just screaming at them. Who do you play in the show? They're like, oh, but, but we have, like, no! Like, I'd be really, be really like, I'd like to see that a lot. But who do you play in the show? Lollipop. I'm man. not in the show. Do I have to be in the show? Yeah. No, you don't, no. Oh, no, you, no, no, you're, no you're producing. producing. Yeah, right. I mean, so, okay, how about I, this? I, I will occasionally, like, frequent his beard. <laughs> uh, Lord, Lord of Doilies, uh, presented by Danny Filth. So it's, it's, it's a show where you've got like get people who make doilies come in and they do competi- competitions like based on this particular doily it, like aesthetic or, or discipline. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, exactly. Only it's, it's hosted by Danny Filth. He looks so cute with all those big doilies, all these little tiny hands holding them. And every time he does something, he, he does or says something sexist, uh, then uh, everyone in the audience wins. So the cradle fetish filth off, or something along those lines. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Lord, Lord of Doily. How about um, reinventing Challenge Annika for the Brexit generation, Theresa May? <laughs> <laughs> Test Theresa or something like that. She, she may. <laughs> <laughs> I do. Uh, blind, I, I blind. would. I would probably pay a lot of money actually to see Theresa May on a on a motorbike. <laughs> was Chana Shanika the one where she was on a motorbike? No, and she had a in helicopter. helicopter. <laughs> yeah, she, I think she, she was on a motorbike a bit. Yeah, yeah. yeah I she would... had to go do something. She had a certain amount of time. She never did it. No, <laughs> I seem to remember her barely could, ever. Could doing you anything. imagine? Like, like, fucking. Let's let's. All right, straight talk right now. You, no, right, no. right, right here. 
we're mean gonna, to we're all of you. We're going to throw down on Challenge Annika right like, now. Theresa May, oh, yeah, right. on, on a fucking Kawasaki Ninja, would that not be fucking hilarious? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Would that... I mean, either... Either she's going to fuck it up and, like, go do those... Go, and then fall over, like, pretty quickly. Mm. And not damage herself too badly. Or she's going to figure it out. And then Theresa May is going, like, 130 down about- the M5. Like a fucking mad cunt. What about, like, Theresa May in a sidecar <laughs> trying like to solve a, a Rubik's cunt. Cube? <laughs> Sorry? Theresa May in a sidecar trying to solve a Rubik's Cube. Uh, I'd quite like to see that. Uh, I mean, what, is that with, with one foot. Is that the name that of the show? <laughs> I, I think it rolls off, rolls in off a the tongue. Trying to solve a Rubik's Cube. I, I think it works. And, and somehow she managed to get, like, tessellating triangles on every face. <laughs> like, well, that's not what you're supposed to do. Well, it's what's happened. Look, it's the one thing I can do. I can't run a country, but I can do this. <laughs> I do blind date with actual blind people with no stage direction. Dun, 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 dun. People just walking aimlessly around the stage. No, you get four blind people that all need a kidney operation. You tell them the hospital is somewhere in that general direction. Whoever who's gets boobs, there. Who's peen? Who's junk am I feeling? Date. Who's boobs? Who's peen? Who's junk am I feeling? Can you imagine they're both standing behind the wall in the big reveal? They, the wall pulls apart and they still can't see each other. <laughs> Or, right. or Danny Dyer on like this like bridge. <laughs> like, Dan- okay, it, now Dan- we're no. fucking talking. No, Danny Dyer like doing yes, but <laughs> yeah, running, write it down. Running commentary on like the the uh, the World Bridge Championships. Yeah. No, 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 <laughs> no, fucking no, no. Amazing. Even better on textile industries because it's a <laughs> surname pun. He's a Dyer. Oh, <laughs> there nice. we go. Nice. Like, this might be a bit controversial, but a three-part series about dementia presented by Billy Connolly. And all three parts are the same part. He's just forgot. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> and all three parts are just, fuck off! <laughs> <laughs> then, Danny Dyer's most dangerous butt flies. <laughs> Danny Dyer's slutty butt flies. <laughs> I, I, would, I would watch... Uh, I would watch lots and lots of Anne Widdicombe going through gay conver- uh, gay conversion therapy. <laughs> lots. Starring Danny Dyer is called Blimey Geezus. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I would, I would, like, I would fucking top to tail that every season. <laughs> I, I would be waiting for it. It would become like my new Jessica Jones. Like, it'd be just like, and every time, just send it to a more extreme gay conversion therapist. It's like, yeah, it's as good. It's just like, it's, it's, it's awful, isn't it? Well, it's a Stanley Dyer screaming at you. <laughs> I mean, no, because I mean, that's enjoyable, let's face it. <laughs> yeah. Squat. It's like ASMR from people from I East said, London. Fuck no, brother. <laughs> it, it's like a. It's like I having, said, nice one, bro. <laughs> it's like having a series run by Vinnie Jones about how to get money back from people. <laughs> That'd be good. <laughs> now, this stage of the uh, of the uh, the negotiation is always tricky, right? But what? What? You see, you see what I do here. Okay, you see. Yeah, we're sitting next to each other, talking. He said, he said no. He said no for the twelfth time. I respect that, and you'll see what I do here. So I go, all right, fair dues, mate. I'm put a hand out and go shake hands. I fucking break his fingers. I yeah, that's how arm, I get my yes. Pull his arm, stick his head in between a car door and a bonnet. Bang. <laughs> Well, but, Dan- but you only give it once because he's still got time. What about Danny Dyer ASMR? You fucking slag. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, uh, okay, so Danny Dyer uh, oh. ta- reading the history of the royal family in ASMR. <laughs> that is, that, that, that right I'd, there I'd give it a is listen. my big jam. Audio. Yeah, I'd be all over that shit, man. Maybe if it's an audio book. Yeah. Um, I don't, I, this is really specific, but Ingvay Mountain driving his Ferrari around California, getting stuck in lots of traffic and getting really annoyed about it. I would really like to see that. <laughs> oh, what is going on here? Do you all know I am Ingvay Mountain <laughs> and I have a 474? Here we go. Now I've got my Ferrari. LA, what's going on? Okay, the lights are going great now. I'm going to go fast. Oh, why are you going fast? Why do you not also have Ferraris? Why is what are you you saying? saying? No, you sound like Adam Boxer's The Queen. <laughs> <laughs> that, that's kind of how I imagine Ing- I've, I've never actually heard the man speak lally that's how I, couple, lally, that- lally couple. <laughs> <laughs> you went too far from the beginning do you know what I think Theresa May's uh, like side project so side money maker side hustle side hustle, uh, side hustle. so you see her husband she a hype man <laughs> yeah, no, 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 no. <laughs> she, she has a like, I reckon she's got like a million followers on SoundCloud no no on, <laughs> on, Theresa on, May the mumble rapper yeah, yeah. <laughs> 
<laughs> no, no, it's Theresa May. <laughs> Theresa May YouTube... drinks the lean, man. <laughs> you know about that drink. It's Theresa May's YouTube channel on Dance Basics 101. <laughs> okay, that's very good. <laughs> yeah, and, and, oh. but but all it is is her just playing through every version of Just Dance ever published. <laughs> <laughs> what What's the name of that flower show? The Chelsea Flower Show. Right. Okay. I clearly <laughs> couldn't remember it. Let's rebrand it. Jeff's Gold Bloom's Golden Bloom. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. There we go. Nice. And it's not a flower show. It's just a show where uh, one by one, Jeff Goldblum walks around and takes a piss on somebody's prolapse anus. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, look at that. The mic is a yeah, I got it. Yeah, it's go a on prolapse yeah. anus. You got, in you've got to know the what. Wild. Yeah, you've got to know some things about the fact. Hashtag FetLife community I mean, right there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Listen to some past episodes. I'm sure you have. <laughs> You're all fucking mental. <laughs> uh, all right, cool. Should we do it? Let's yeah. take a break. Go on, you can do the silence clap. Go on. Oh, big boy host. I'm such a big <laughs> boy. <laughs> All right, okay, cool, sweet. Before we crack on with the next topic, which, uh, remind me, I think is host part coming from... Me. Johnny. Uh, no, no, Johnny, no, me. Johnny from hasn't Greg. gone yet. All right, cool. So we did we did this off of, uh, off air. Mm. Um, so we had a we had a backup uh, whiskey because it was a small whiskey and there's five of us. Mm-hmm. Uh, before uh, we did the show, I took the little foil ring off, so oh, that yes. it allows you to take the the, uh, the top off. Yes. And I gave it to Johnny, and I yeah. said to Johnny, he's like, "All right, mate, you're you're a big whiskey boy. Uh, tell me from this small bit of foil, what do you think this whiskey is?" And uh, Johnny, I kept it in my hair, so. <laughs> well, but the, can you remember your okay. answer? I think well, you no, said no, because my, my, my original, old answer, was, my original answer was Glenfiddich 15 because it matches the colour. Glenfiddich 15. I think so, no, so. Glenfiddich 15. Oh, Glenfiddich 15. Yeah, because it's a slightly different brown. Um, Glenfiddich 15. Yeah, but then I said oh. you've never had that in the house. All right, but, but otherwise, so, it do you want to change it to the other answer? Would, would you care to uh, tell us what the whiskey is? <laughs> is it the Glenlivet 15? No, it's the Glenlivet 12. Oh, oh, oh yeah, yeah, bitch! Yeah. You've got a bottle of Glenlivet 12. Oh, another sweet whiskey. Tom got very excited because <laughs> that thing that Tesco's had that back in for a little bit, and it was super cheap. And then obviously they sold it. Oh, I, I fucking I, I, whiskey, I bought this shit from um, oh, hang on. fucking what pineapple legend? and vanilla in your fucking face. Yeah, I, I bought this. Um, I, Do you I want think... to start the start the timer? Oh yeah, thank you. Uh, I, I thought this was. This? I, I bought this from uh, co-op not got down my road months and months <laughs> ago. I'm almost empty. <laughs> See, I'm, I'm really taking my time with this. So, <laughs> I've been you know, I scold it and now I'm doing the gamma yeah. ray. <laughs> I've, been, I've been sitting on this for a while, so everyone yeah, dig like, in. I'm almost on my second day, Dinko. Get your glen up. I will become at one stage unable to understand oh, what, it feels, what I'm saying. This shit is my favourite. This fucking mm. still distillery. You were the last topic. Okay, cool. So uh, the eighteen is Greg, a masterpiece. You want to oh, grab one man. from uh, Il Communité? Uh, no, he, he's Nikas. still got so much knicker. Yeah. I, I'm on good, mate. Should I put it over here? Uh, no. no, no, a bit closer here. Yeah, there yeah. we go in my lap. <laughs> Thank you. Because at least if it's in Tom's lap, I know it's accessible. <laughs> well. And welcoming. As many will tell you. <laughs> Wait, it, it, this Comes is a, with mighty, mighty sausage. <laughs> <laughs> this is a community chest, isn't this it? Is, yeah, it is, yeah, yeah. yeah. Sophie's chest, right Sophie's in here. Chest, hands. So, so shout out to the community that listens to us. Just... We call them the Endurers. The Endurers. Um, just... I'm, I'm pretty sure we showed the pictures of the... Oh... There's only four left in whoa, here. Eight, whoa, no, wait, I don't want to give wait, you... Whoa, whoa, whoa. Wait, there, eight, was, eight, eight. there was nothing left in there. There was nothing left in there, and they came through uh, for us in a very short amount of time. I will not have you shit on the injuries. We already do that enough to them anyway. Look, let's put it this way. You're to blame, because me and Taryn left alone on a podcast... <laughs> Will burn topics. Wait, true, also, true, so true, all you true, hosts true. that didn't turn up, yeah, also, fucking turn up. Fuck you guys. Fuck off. Get out. We don't uh, need you. Yeah, I can't don't come need come you anymore. Where, where's the colossal guilt trip come from, you fucking host? <laughs> you know, oh, I, I don't fucking know. <laughs> I don't know where has it come from. Host like a virus. Yeah. Well, it hasn't mate, come yeah. from yeah. you because yeah. you weren't fucking here. Well, do you know what? Cancerous spores. The lot of you. Oh my god. I'll sooner shit on you than than our endurers. Fine. You host this shit. I'm done. So the black mold has left the building <laughs> cool what's the topic great <laughs> I'm sorry that's quite a cool rap name <laughs> black mold, black mold. I, am, best I am stiff chocolate I am black mold <laughs> <laughs> okay so this topic is from no, no. Rickard you absolute and unequivocal genius okay <laughs> we'll be the judge of that go on <laughs> do continue happy midsummer yeah no 
That was like yesterday? Fucking right Friday. around quick. Friday. Yeah, it was yesterday. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Like, that's almost spot Today's on Saturday. timing on actually us getting drunk. It's like he put in a topic Last about week. three hours ago and I printed them all. <laughs> and then cut them <laughs> and on the four podcast. Of them. <laughs> I mean, I, I can't help but wonder if part of his thought process was like, oh, okay, and they're, they're all a bunch of like, English people. And I've got, okay, right, <laughs> let's, let's, I'll put in something about the weather. They'll have something to talk about. <laughs> and, and to be fair, like when, when June started... <laughs> one, of, one of them's a hippie, they'll have something to yeah. do with the solstice. Go on. Like, <laughs> June, June started, uh, obviously, like uh, a, a few weeks ago. And, like, <laughs> she never that's, fucking stops, does she, June? That, that's uh, fucking, like, she's okay. worse than April. Not, not until summer July. starts and all of a sudden, like, uh, may I? England decides to give us spring uh, at last. It's been, it's been <gasps> lovely. Roll it back. Celebrity TV show, Mother May I. <laughs> <laughs> it's a, a sub-dom show starring Theresa May. <laughs> <laughs> and a lesbian dominatrix. <laughs> Dumb. Oh, it's all, what was, what was all your one? My, 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 my Jeremy Scavenger Hunt. Yeah, I'm there sure. we go. <laughs> Jeremy <laughs> Hunt Scavenger Hunt. Because well, like Mummy Mayo, he's trying to find like what like he a, stands uh, for. Yeah, <laughs> he's <laughs> trying to find Paul Bart Cop. <laughs> oh God! Now, to, drag Hunt, a, Hunt. to drag it back to the to the topic at hand. <laughs> no, fuck off! Well, no, no, no. Like I reckon this can, if we use the right mindset, be an absolute oh. gem. Let's let's let's, let's right, workshop that mindset, shall yeah, we? Yeah, yeah. So set, set us up. So each of you go through your mind and think <laughs> of. All right, done. Who <laughs> ah! <laughs> <laughs> put that there? <laughs> oh Wait. my god! Why do you keep making me do this to me? Curse you, God, for making me this way. <laughs> this many lava lamps. <laughs> <laughs> I don't uh, remember that. <laughs> Oh, I'm yeah, pretty so sure I can also put salmon. cabbage in it. Who varnished the so, salmon? So, guys, can I just get a vote? Uh, 50% whiskey, days. good idea. <laughs> Hell yeah. I'm, lo- I'm loving the, uh, the the mid-afternoon chaotic energy. It's very good. <laughs> yeah. Sorry, chaotic sorry, bad. Uh, sorry. Like, cor- like yeah. hot... Um, the choral stomp in trying to take through it through our minds. Yeah, we're going through our minds, yeah. yeah. Go through your minds. What I want you to do is, what do you think he meant by mid- happy midsummer? Um, so, you know this thing called summer, which we don't really get in England. No, no, you've got but... to extrapolate how you think. Pims and buggery. So, like, happy... <laughs> 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 I kind of wish the endurance had seen my face at that point, because that was just pure... <laughs> <laughs> like, uh, when I, when I, I mean, read that... That, that sounds like that an exclamation of three? surprise that fucking um, Captain Haddock Sarty would bar, say. Bar, from... Pims and buggery. <laughs> <laughs> like, could, could you imagine, like, Captain Haddock from the Tintin novels going, oh, Pims! A buggery. <laughs> <laughs> See, when I read that, I immediately saw a picture of him going "Happy Midsummer" and just being absolutely wasted because it's finally warm. What? And he's just like <laughs> he's just an Indian. We need an excuse. He's just an Indian. It's winter. No, I, 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 also he's a Viking, so he doesn't get real drunk. He, he, he just gets he, he, he gets really get tipsy. warm. Yeah, he, he's all, he's also got to be ready to invade at any point, so he can't get too drunk. No, I think that's probably why he lives in a country with government controlled alcohol. It's because they don't want a Viking uprising. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, fair dues. Okay, so what do I think when what I think? What did you tweak? Like, I didn't tweak anything. You get off my board. Don't no, you touch I've my knobs. <laughs> I've got to oh, touch your knobs as much as I want. You're only supposed to touch Tara, stop, it, way. stop it, Taryn. Stop it. No, I'm stop not going to stop it. And what did you just turn down? Can I ask for a brief consensus? <laughs> let, let me show you what I did. Let's see what's going on. Oh, that's your one, isn't it? You just muted myself. Okay, yeah, yeah. Uh, oh, uh, um, can I ask you guys? Yeah. I have, I have, I have something I want to check oh with you. Oh, my God. Yeah. I had to help you then. Sorry, I forgot it wasn't completely set up. Nice. That's what I think of when I think of Midsummer. Was that God? Yes, I think of gods. I think of pagan gods. <laughs> oh, shit. I'm going to go see Midsummer Night's Dream. Me oh, too. Oh, oh where are you going? Regions, oh, nice. open, Regions air. open Air. Oh, shit. We need to check Oh, dates. shit. Oh, hello. You might be sitting with the Ryan clan, mate. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, that'd be lovely. Yeah, it is. We get really drunk, especially if it gets rained off. My dad almost picked a fight last time. <laughs> oh, wonderful. We had, with who? We did, we, well, we, to be fair, it doesn't matter. We had six bottles of rosé between six of us. <laughs> I, I'd, I'd, so I'd, like, I'd like to imagine Dell picking a fight with the sky. <laughs> He's like, we oh, made no, good no. money for it these was, It was so funny. Like, it's a, you cumulus bastards! He was being <laughs> drunk and not aware of his surroundings, stomping in a... a, a puddle basically and soaking a couple that were sat way too close to us i'm going on the 9th of july and no no i'm going like no no um, i've always but imagined we'll compare notes yes we and oh for, right, so for the back to my playing, dad picking um, a fight for the interior is playing uh pot topic assassin you now know where johnny's going to be 
<laughs> and when Regent's Park mm-hmm. all you need to do July. is kill him and then you get put into the raffle oh no one listens <laughs> to this we're fine we're not going to dox Johnny <laughs> <laughs> if I get assassinated at an outdoor Shakespeare show, what if, it, what if it was by me though? And it was hosted by a celebrity. What would it be called? Danny Dyer's. Re- <laughs> Watch him Dyer. D- Danny Dyer's regal. No. no. Patrick Stewart's celebrity shake off. <laughs> no. I'm Danny big... Dyer gets Queen Titania higher. Danny Dyer is a big fan of Somali and Gypsy Wedding. Get him out of there. <laughs> no, I have seen Midsummer Night. Dream dumb in a gypsy caravan site. <laughs> that was really good. That would have been really good. Actually. I, I mean, I've seen um, I've, I've seen uh, Lords and Ladies by Terry Pratchett performed in the woods just down the road. I really? like that. Was yeah, it a one man show it. and a one man audience by any chance, Darren? <laughs> <laughs> or were you just yes? Or were, <laughs> was it oh, you that... and the drunk down the street again, Darren? <laughs> you say that. You say that. Though, it, it, was, it was. It was basically. Uh, it was basically. What, yeah, is he fine. your Tyler Durden, Darren? <laughs> I, I did a sex on the tree. <laughs> <laughs> Back to the trees. <laughs> I've got this metal image uh, of 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 your of your dad, Tom. Oh yeah, no, him picking getting, a fight, uh, getting horrendously pissed. And what he's picking a fight of is the fact that he's fallen into a bush and he's fighting the f- bush. <laughs> okay, okay, let me just explain the situation very quickly then. Pissing down with rain, everyone from an entire theatre crammed under one shelter in front of a bar. That's the Ryan's natural habitat. <laughs> yeah, yeah, <laughs> we yeah. are of getting wankered, and he's accidentally stomping in this puddle and soaking a couple that was sat to, on a table next to us at which point the guy's just giving him grief like i'm sorry stop please can you fucking stop can you fucking stop and my dad just like a little turbulent teen like toddler just goes no and just stomps in this puddle <laughs> <laughs> yes yes and it's just like okay dad's become a problem let's get him out of it <laughs> Now, I know you can't see this. Dell problem, Ryan. But I, 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 <laughs> Hashtag I, problem. I'm currently tipping my hat to Mr. Ryan. <laughs> oh, man. It was it was the simultaneous moment of absolute, like, oh, shit, we need to get him out of him. Because I don't want to s- defend my dad in a fight. Because that Security. just doesn't feel right. <laughs> I don't think you'd need to defend your dad in a fight by the sounds of it. I don't know. I'm, I'm all about, like, if your dad's going to uh. pick a fight. Um, just, Sorry, just, just, just let it happen. Don't defend him. Just let, let him get involved. Exactly. He's big enough and ugly enough to look after. To be himself. fair, enough, fair, he's let me down many drinking competitions. I'm pretty sure I've met. <laughs> oh, your really? Dad. No, I, I have this thing where I go up to my dad when I'm absolutely sourced and just like t- try and get him to down a pint with me. Tom, I'm pretty. <laughs> he just won't. He's not an idiot. Tom, I'm pretty sure I met your dad in a mosh pit at a Datsik uh, event at Fabric. A <laughs> dancing gig of fabric. <laughs> oh, that was a follow on show to um, Slayer at Heaven, wasn't it? Yeah. 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, that reminds me of the time I went to see uh, Dido at Slimelight. <laughs> <laughs> it's where I saw. Uh, uh, that, that reminds me of where I saw status quo you... at Coco. <laughs> <laughs> Coco, thank you. I've been trying to remember the name of that fucking venue for the past two weeks, and it's I now can't venue, remember why. <laughs> it's a decent venue, to be fair. I actually did see that sick there. Do you know what? My, oh, my, nice. my favorite Daddy Ryan. Danzig. Uh, <laughs> Dad sick. Danzig. You Dan- saw Danzig at Coco. That no, seems like no. a good place. To I saw Dad sick. It's, it's my dad in hospital. Your dad threw up on Danzig. <laughs> Many but where move. That was my dancing impression. <laughs> like, my my, my favourite, uh, like Daddy Ryan moment, uh, has got to be that time there he just got the right level of drunk and poured an entire drink all over our host, Ty, like Tom Ryan, and I was there just absolutely wanking, going. That's no, I, I think that's when I challenged him to a Guinness drinking contest. That sounds like a terrible <laughs> idea. Just, I was just like being a prick, going, nah, fuck you, fuck, uh, and down it, and he just poured a pint over my head, and he went, there you go, I'll finish first. <laughs> <laughs> and nice. And then Tom glassed him. <laughs> uh, and then I took his girl and fucked up, right? Uh, <laughs> and fucked him. <laughs> More than he's done for years. Uh, anyway, oh. I did. I did see someone put up a, a thing uh, recently for Father's Day. <laughs> That's what she said. It was very simple. It's like, <laughs> Happy Father's Day, motherfuckers. <laughs> yeah, no, that was Scrooge Pip. <laughs> it was, wasn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so you, you, your, um, your uh, dancing impression has such a cadence to it. It's giving me an idea. I would love to see a biopic uh, wherein Matt Berry <laughs> plays Danzig. Wait, wait, sorry. Oh, Who's Danzig? 
Dan- Danzig is because um, <laughs> we were talking about Merlin. Oh Merlin. God! Like what? What is what is a Danzig? So he is. He did that song, Mother. <laughs> he's like he's Mother. Oh. He's he's oh. kind of so. If you imagine like uh, Dio as uh, Dio James Hetfield, uh, Bruce Dickinson, like, they're like the A list and, and like super S rank of of metal stardom. Danzig is somewhere down in the C's and the D's. He's been oh, there. He's been he's consistent. Culty, he's though. Super culty, yeah. He's, he's, uh, but he, he's, he's he is like an original. Like he's he, been around. Since. If, if you were into stepping and smoking a cigarette while you dance to very slow, boring <laughs> metal, yeah, <laughs> no, that, absolutely. <laughs> That's your man. <laughs> what, like so Mary Solstice, in? everyone. Yeah, yeah. 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 Mary yeah. Solstice dancing. Summer. Can we just Pray- say oh, Mary Solstice dancing? Yeah, yeah. Praise I mean, the he sun. He deserves it. Praise the sun. I completely lost the thread. Like, Good. Uh, draw, draw another topic. From Much the hot like our listeners. My yeah, it's, uh, where you go. One. Yeah, yeah. one from the community. Submit a topic at podtopicpodcast.com. <laughs> oh, God, I kind of want to make a theme out of that. This is the theme to the community chest. <laughs> oh, God. Well, okay, Adam Bucks. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Adam Bucks. Oh, it's from me. Adam, Adam Bucks. Oh, yeah. oh, oh, wait. Johnny's got a very large topic. It's from me. It's a visual joke. Okay. <laughs> um, what what names would people who don't listen to death metal give to death metal bands? Oh, this this came from a friend of mine in Turkey who who when we were really like wasted came up with the name Abortion Clinic Bomb Squad for a death metal band. <laughs> Um, <laughs> I think about Americans' <laughs> audacious, aud- aud- like, aud- audacious abortion. <laughs> I, I, still, audacious. I still can't get over the fact that the two people that weren't in the room when we, dis- we discussed the plan of pulling <laughs> yeah. out the world's smallest topic and then reading the world's not <laughs> barely not thing on that paper, piece of paper. There's just nothing on the paper. He just wanted to do this topic. <laughs> 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 I was trying to convince him to do it at arm's length, like he yeah, didn't yeah. need reading glasses. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I did also miss the topic. <laughs> I, was, I was reminded death of a metal story. band names, basically. Yeah, 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 from people, people who don't, don't listen to death metal, that's yeah, the important yeah. thing. Yeah, exactly. People don't know what death metal is, naming death metal bands. Christian undercarriage. <laughs> <laughs> delightfully weird <laughs> uh, I, I really like that <laughs> Christian undercarriage yeah I, I reckon uh, there'd two, be two, um... two, like, and th- these are the numbers two skulls two buried <laughs> I love that porn clip <laughs> that's a... <laughs> Danny Dyer in a colostomy bag Danny Dyer's back again <laughs> I mean he is he's he, I mean, he is, he's a multi-genre actor <laughs> he, he's like he's like um gold Doom. Gold Blooms, uh, Gold Semigod. Doom, Gold Doom, Gold Doom. It's a band entirely Jeff Goldblum. And it being Doom, just that looped uh, for about again, 10 minutes. It's <laughs> like Witch House, but... Like... And then someone with a bit of airy-fairy reverb vocals go... Okay, that's actually Witch House. I, and the thing is, you could then, you could, no, no, you could, no, then, that's you could how... then slow it down 75% and call it a Boris cover. <laughs> I believe that noise is created by the harmonica just between his butt cheeks. Who's harmonica? Where can I get a number? Because I want to kiss that girl. <laughs> but to, to to the point, I, I would lick her teeth for sure. <laughs> <laughs> I'd a mile of a shit to see where those, those lips kissed. <laughs> to the to-, to the. <laughs> To the topic, um, I, do you know what I've come up with? I've come up with uh, violent anal crucifixion. Anal crucifixion is always a good road. Yep. I like, <laughs> you, you've got to put something that's slightly death metally with the crucifixion. I, I, and then writing, just, writing a children's book, anal crucifixion. But by the same token, I'd also love to see what a non-violent anal crucifixion would look like. <laughs> just, we're just going to pop it. Maybe more Vaseline? More Vaseline. <laughs> Sorry, we're just gonna get you on all four pegs, and then I'm gonna oh. crank this to stretch. Oh, sorry, it's but you, you you do the cranking yourself, so it's not violence. Uh, it's it's this you doing to yourself. It's all good. Well, basically, they've just <laughs> anal no gaff <laughs> straight in there. They've just found the super king, um, absolute Bristol. top of the league <laughs> of uh, masochists. 
Fit life. <laughs> <Hashtag> <laughs> <laughs> Follow Fat Life on Facebook. Uh, so, so okay. So, what what kind of metal are we talking about? Metal band names. Well, it's death metal. We go death metal. When I'm thinking death metal, what have we got? Citadel hysterectomy. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> That's nice. Yeah, it's very good. Yeah, yeah. It's got a good ring to it. <laughs> um, <laughs> Harlequin Ichthyosis Death Squad. <laughs> Oh, Jesus, that, that's a nice... Scotchio. That's got, nice, that's got a, nice, a nice enunciation to it's it. It's got a cadence, hasn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Got, got to appreciate it. I mean, uh, of course, uh, I feel very bad for everyone who does suffer from hardcore ichthyosis. It looks very uncomfortable, which is putting it very mildly. Uh, in the meantime... <laughs> Cthulhu hula hoops through the Jews. <laughs> <laughs> Jula hoops is basically what you're saying. Yeah. Multiple equine no, detonations. Cthulhu hoops. <laughs> yeah, yeah, Cthulhu. Oh, oh, say that again. That was beautiful. Multiple equine detonations. <laughs> equine's always a good chance. <laughs> equine's always. <laughs> uh, ba- ba- basically, it's uh, is it, look, you don't write it down in letters. You create a visual representation of a particular grand national race where every horse that falls down and won't get up explodes upon contact. <laughs> <laughs> All packed into one multi-dimensional symbol. And then it just finishes with... (laughs) A West End musical death metal band called Munchkin Death Decapitation. (laughs) Aww. (laughs) No, no, a West End show called Be the Change You Want to Be. (laughs) Oh, Jesus! (laughs) Uh, oh, this, is, this is weird. I've usually got plenty of band names to go on hand, but um, that fifty percent, fifty percent whiskey has absolutely floored me. <laughs> I'm, see, I'm I'm a good workman. That's I'm not going to blame my tools. That's his West End. This is in fact my own inadequacy. I won't either. Ring right now. Spiral back. Keep going. <laughs> no, no, that was his West End play title. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, that's that's the name of your sex tape. What my? <laughs> What was it? Let's, okay, <laughs> right, fine, fine. Let's do, let's do a quick diversion. Right, what what is the name of everyone's sex tape? <laughs> do we have to name each other's? Oh, Sorry, are we, we, are we name naming each our own? Right, I think if we do either, we're coming out ahead. Which is what <laughs> well, I'm going to call yeah. my tape. <laughs> uh, Luke, 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 I'm going to suggest his sex tape because it's called Schrodinger's Cream Pie. <laughs> 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 if I leave, it's like I never came inside. <laughs> Where's my taxi fare? <laughs> it's the name of Greg's sex <laughs> 15 dead dogs and a hot air balloon. <laughs> <laughs> so Man- that's, that's Max Scoville's autobiography. 12 reasons day. why I hate my mother. <laughs> Sh- shoal of mantegays. Like, Tyrone, I reckon yours is uh, Don't Make It Weird. <laughs> Oh, it's ironic because it's weird the entire way through. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! Like you, the, the the outside of your left calf is so fucking pretty. <laughs> oh my god, your left calf so fucking pretty. Look at it; it's so. Oh man, the definition of that. No, don't show me the right calf. Fuck off. Yeah, that left calf, bitch. Yeah. That's... Now I am for me. <laughs> With your irony. <laughs> <laughs> My eye fetish, the trees have eyes. That's why I'm giving on trees with googly eyes. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Is it end yet? <laughs> oh, <what>? Nice. <laughs> hey, come nice, on. Nice, nice. Come on, my Tolkien oh, massive. Oh, yeah, yeah. They don't <laughs> Let's deploy, get a applause. Hang up, hang up. She's so wet for a dryad. <laughs> <laughs> Let's keep going with the Tolkien porn. Come on. Yeah. <laughs> New rich vein of comedy gold. Come on, let's go. Oh, no, I've got... I've, 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 I've quite, quite gold, simply yeah. wood nymph. <laughs> <laughs> I've got to go down the route of... I can't believe it's not butter. What? Okay. Go on. <laughs> because it's cream. Oh, it's <laughs> because her pussy's that tight. It's not her butt... Uh, <laughs> but. <laughs> 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 I'm trying to work for you here, man. It's not a good title. <laughs> Churn it up. It was it Missy Elliott that did that, did that, did <laughs> yeah, that song? That my crack. pussy, my crack. No, my no back. that was the fucking. What was that group? There's a no. girl. It's a bunch of girls. My neck, my back, my yeah. lick, my pussy, and my crack. Destiny's Mandem. Okay, okay. So you didn't remind me. I think of... it was All Saints. <laughs> Wasn't it the Destiny's Mandem? No, <laughs> Destiny's Mandem. <laughs> <laughs> 
So, uh, Greg, you just remind me of a very, very good meme that is actually readable. Um, have you seen the one of the butter replacements uh, as uh, attached to the stages yeah, of grief? Yeah. So it is for denial. I can't believe it's not butter. Anger. What? Not butter? Bargaining. Could it be butter? <laughs> Depression. This is not butter. <laughs> Acceptance. Margarine. <laughs> <laughs> All right, that's pretty good. Uh, I do like him. Yeah, oh, I've, I've seen another one similar to that, which is like, it's just like, I can't believe it's, but- it's not butter. I can't believe you thought this was butter. This is definitely not butter. Like, it's just like... A buttermilk replacement margarine for werewolves. I can't believe it's... <laughs> I like him. <laughs> that's my favourite D&D story oh that's line. a walk <laughs> werewolf their castle <laughs> you a little bit like mar- a trope there you should be a marketer to try and sell <laughs> like normal products to D&D players okay cool uh, so Sh- shall we on move sh- shall we move on wait wait oh, wait, 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 wait. oh god like li- listen to me talking like Yoda <laughs> shut Gentlemen, shall we move on? Shall we on move? Us? How long we got left? Uh, We have some time, dude. Before we move on, I do have. (laughs) Oh yeah, yeah. We get to the rough bit. We we're getting (laughs) sloppy. (laughs) You might (laughs) notice. Like this is getting sloppy. Tom, I I am. I'm very considering suggesting we we start moving this down to an hour and a half theme because we keep getting to the like the hour and a half point. Going, is it done yet? (laughs) It's like this would seem like a natural stopping point, but no. Let me put it this way: (laughs) we are white men on the internet talking about nothing I'm like, I'm actually <laughs> we back. need our edge that's the one that's the half an hour at the end edge oh, right true. there Did that's the sloppiness that, that we're talking about was it was the half an hour at the end the uh, play the eastenders theme play coronation street yeah no, play that, street yeah no that was oh one yeah of we moments. used to sing the, the the yeah no no when i had to edit the no shit do you remember when he kept oh, edge, play yes. sweet dreams of made these play eastenders theme play well, coronation no, street. i mean that's supposed to be the last five minutes no, but that ended up as the last half an hour of that episode. <laughs> Cheers. Uh, okay, Can I get cool. a Pearl and Codeine interlude very quickly? Oh, God, I'm all tingly. Ooh. <laughs> Codeine. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> so, Seal asks... Oh, hello. Oh, hello. What is hello, the, hello, then? hello. What is the most creative, oh, good, non-sexual use you can come up with for a penis? Um, oh shit! I know what this <laughs> conversation's relating to. I'm um, glad you put this in. Trying, so, uh, trying so, to feed a needle when you're sewing. I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. I'm going to interject with oh, possibly nice. my favourite one that we came up with, which was as a clapper meter. All you need is a, pl- a paper plate coloured in red from green. Hold it up against your unerect schlong, and then just as the applause happens, just make it work. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> 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 if you want to go down the... Uh... I did follow it up by pretty much miming it with a semi on. <laughs> now, I wonder... <laughs> I wonder how popular Miming with a is. semi has a really nice ring to it. Oh, just tight, tight in those Wait, muscles. There's when, a TV show, yeah, miming yeah. with a semi. Danny Dyer's, Danny Dyer's miming with, with a Billy semi. With Billy the Mime. With Billy the Mime. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay, fine. Do you know what? I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to start off with my shit one. The shit one that immediately came up to me is figuring out exactly how much... Like, how well you could play slap bass with like a semi <laughs> but i just thought of another one all right okay so we're gonna go with the, the classic tent pole thing so you attach one <laughs> you <laughs> sorry i remember what my favorite one was going okay cool like... so so imagine you are uh, like you there, there's you and there is your partner and you're with child you um and uh your partner is about to feed the child in public now, some people get really fucking antsy about it. So I'm thinking the way to shift focus is if they need a cover. So you attach one end of a, um, of, of like a, a cover to their shoulder. And then you have the other end attached to your massively erect penis as the trend, uh, as the tent pole, creating like a barrier between them while they breastfeed the child. <laughs> That's as about as non-sexual. Beautiful. And also I would do that. No, I've got one. Go for it. This was my favourite one that we came up with. Uh, if you ever need to prove and catch fairy folk, paint it like a toadstool and wait. 
<laughs> Seriously, we were doing this for about two hours, wankered at like 4 a.m. <laughs> <laughs> so strap in, because we're about to do the same. <laughs> okay, or so. Strap on. So uh, there we go. So, it's not so, sexual. <laughs> So basically, uh, obviously, so we've got to make some alterations for, for wear and tear. But um, so you're playing Wheel of Fortune, right? <laughs> and so, yeah. so what you're, you're lying on a board. Hoping for not Face down it. above the no wheel. No whammies, no whammies. You don't leave your, your hard on in front of the spokes. Yeah. But what you do is. Oh, um, God. Oh, you no, count, no. And you just drop it no. and it just catches. This is oh. some Guantanamo shit. Just like the. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, no part of ISIS. <laughs> <laughs> I'll tell you any ISIS you need to know. Anything. I just tell you, give me some names. I'll tell you about them. Yes, he has dog. <laughs> Donald yeah. Trump is Torture ISIS. works, people. It's the most successful thing that's ever happened. So we, the most likely... event, Wheel of ISIS. Is that basically what we're playing now? <laughs> Wheel of ISIS! <laughs> so the real question comes down to whether or not, at the point... Like, is it so painful that you don't want to go through it again? Or is it a such so well or so good that they take it away and then get, you get answers from that taking well, away? Well, there's only one way to find out. Your Fire! time to spin the wheel of ISIS! When you said that, I just assumed uh, there's jihad, only one jihad, way to find jihad, out. Fine! <laughs> okay, so how about this, right? So ISIS you know, versus la, la, the wheel la, of fortune. La, 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 la. You, you know when you're cooking a big roast? And uh, you kind of get into about the finish time, and it might finish early, it might finish, like, it might take a bit more time. You never know. You need to jam a thermometer in it. Sounds mm -hmm. like my sex life. Right. Yeah, yeah. Your, That's not your not your dick is is that thermometer. <laughs> <laughs> That's That's. No. There's a pretty non sexual use. Yeah, no, but anything over 32 degrees body temperature is going to be absolute agony. <laughs> I've seen it. But could you imagine if you fucking busted through to like the, to, to the breastbone from the top and... Oh, uh, no, you're talking about breastbone like, now. This is going sexual. Going, you're right. Oh, oh, actually, no, that's, that's, that's actually pretty wow, sexual that down there. Yeah, I fucking bet you did. Because you pushed in at the same time I you did. screamed. <laughs> <laughs> I've, I've, that's I've, what she said. <laughs> listen, I'm sorry, Indra, for my lack of uh, professionality. That's um, it's it's inexcusable. Pa, pa, it's a fact that you're right. You're listening to a punk cast. I've actually got a story, uh, well, about the most creative use I've personally seen in real life of uh, foreskin, which was uh, w one time I was going through my cupboard. In, foreskin of uh, 10 years ago. Uh, yeah. <laughs> 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 Remember it. That's going to be written down. We, we got a title right there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> yes. So I, I was going through. Foreskin of 10 years ago. So Our four skin fathers. <laughs> <laughs> the story slowly unfolded. Oh my god! Like a turtleneck. So, <laughs> it's everyone's inalienable right, right to pursue <laughs> fappiness. <laughs> it's everyone's got given right to everyone's, look like an anteater. Everyone's got the right to bare skin. <laughs> <laughs> Bear or, skin, bro. Or <laughs> bear skin. Or, or if you're particularly well hung, bear arms <laughs> holding an apple. Oh, very well done. Bear arms. See, what, see, okay, hang on, let me, let me throw this away, to you. Wait. Hang on, go on. And... <laughs> <laughs> no, no, wait, sorry. I was in the middle of the story, right? I'm Were sorry. you? <laughs> apologies, apologies. I'd already forgotten. Start again. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> so well, I was in my, uh, when when I was living with my mum many years ago. Um, I'm not sure if uh, English people probably get this, but there used to be a trend of before there was like the internet, like easily accessible torrentable internet. Just so you know, to, at the tip you yeah, we, we, were the going, we were going for non-sexual. We're talking <laughs> about no, your no, mum and early no, days right, of no, porn. No, right. so. <laughs> so, the tip does count. Wait, wait, so people people used to buy like DVDs off of like usually Chinese people at street corners selling free for five, right? Who remembers that in England? Um, mine was uh, Darren, but yeah. <laughs> was that actually... No. Oh. <laughs> but anyway, so well, I remember going through the cupboard looking for one of these DVDs, and I uh, I stumbled across one of my mum's DVDs, which was like it's a knot tying foreskin DVD. So it's a DVD of people oh. doing magic and special <laughs> knots with I was going to say, I thought it was people failing to tie the, like, or just not doing that, that um, with their force. No, 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 that no, explains so... the sheep shank through and through. That's <laughs> no, a Welsh invention, so, isn't it? So I was like, I was like, yeah, that's well, probably... That, that's just what they call their dicks. That's probably the most creative if, thing if I've ever seen with a foreskin in real life. Like, if we're not talking conceptually... Is this peanut puppetry of the penis? Yeah. Oh, okay, yeah, like doing the Eiffel Tower and shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah literally. Yeah. Like, that's... That's, that's, I that's, that's a good show. I, I don't know if <laughs> yeah. my mum fucked to it or watched it, but it was fucking jokes. 
<laughs> could you imagine if you were blind and the <laughs> only way? Right there. Could you imagine if you were blind and you you could never quite figure out braille with your fingers, but on your bell end, <laughs> like spot fucking on every time. <laughs> Literally. <laughs> <laughs> not not sex. <laughs> or you can read his G. <laughs> I mean, that'd be a pretty non-sexual use for the penis, right there. What? Just reading Braille with it. Yeah. <laughs> it's like, oh, just like fucking whap down. I don't know. It depends. So stretch out the uh, the foreskin. Just go. Mm, ah. And then it comes out in ripples on your ball sack. <laughs> like, <laughs> like calligraphy what, like, of the balls. What like scripture? <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> uh, everyone, everyone, stop, stop, stop. stop an Australian stop. has raised his hand. The Coral Stomp has something to say. So, so <laughs> I've come up with three different versions. Straight so, far, right? so the most. The most <laughs> The most useless, useless version for a penis is as a fan because it's too hot. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty far away from where you probably want to cool. Yeah, Although, it, unless it's your nuts. Yeah. Unless it, you're like, yeah. The well, beast. I'm talking with somebody else. UFC. Right. Uh, you got me, blood. And then the most useful um, one that I've come up with is as a doorstop. What? Are you fucking crazy? I didn't say it was pleasurable. Well, this um, is non-sexual, so technically... Is this it can a dismembered... Be no, 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 no. To, to be fair, that would be, like, a soft penis would work very well as a doorstop. So, <laughs> like, as long as we're, like, talking about a certain height above, above yeah. like, the ground. Hitting yeah. mic stands would what be a bad would... use for a penis, too. <laughs> and the, and the penis third one... doesn't have a certain height above <laughs> the ground? <laughs> and the third one that I... Oh, here we go. Oh, here comes oh, Taron's penis. Oh, Everyone's seeing yeah, it. Great. And he missed. And he oh, missed. And he missed. <laughs> Oh, there, we there we go. That was Terence Penis You're against my phone. I sound... will mark it for future reference. You're not listening <laughs> to the sound of Terence Penis 95.4. Okay, we've always got drunk on this podcast. We've never got ah! so drunk that you've whacked your bell end against the Sorry, fucking I pink no. mic. So, well, he's <laughs> lagging. He's lagging. Oh, is that, is that lag pain? Yeah, no, lag. When, when my trousers were down, evidently my headphone early got wrapped around my bollocks. So as I tried to pull it out, garrot I, your turtle I, I, neck. I, I, I believe that's my bollocks. <laughs> Off with his head! I believe that's what we call S and M fifty seven. Hashtag fit life. <laughs> call that cock karma. Yeah. <laughs> that's what they call that. But, but to finish the number three and most, <laughs> thank God, Greg, the trilogy. trilogy. Most creative I, I one that I could come up with. Yeah, the only creative <laughs> one that I could come up with was as a um, as a plug for the sink. No. Oh. No, it'd be shit oh. for the sink. There's too many holes. No, these aren't supposed to be nasty. No, these no. are supposed to be funny. Come exactly. on. Yeah, no, no. Like it's just like you got to do the dishes. You don't find a plug. You can use it. I mean, I, I, okay. I'm, I'm gonna, I'm, I'm gonna call a stop on the last one purely because um, you can't. That is exactly what he was M- Most penises actually. can't block a sink alone. You as a measuring to stick the to make sure well, that kids' is... sandcastles are up to um, health and safety standards. Just just a health and safety, <laughs> kids. Don't try and block a sink with your dick. No. Obviously. No, Taron, I will not take the topic pot. I swear this will last the rest of the episode. <laughs> it won't, because I've got, I've got the last uh, topic right here. So um, uh, it's, it's, been, it's been sent via the group chat. Needs to happen because we're already messy. How long I, we got? How uh, long we got? Uh, we have uh, uh, about 120 minutes. minutes. Yeah. Right, so we've got 20 minutes of penis talk. Let's keep going. So, uh, my if, penis if, 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 can if you, tell. If you shoot blanks, could you call it fapid? Can, can we... <laughs> <laughs> That's so good. Have you guys seen that, that Daniel. What's, it, who, what's Harry Potter's real name? Radcliffe. Daniel Radcliffe. Daniel Radcliffe's uh, film where his penis points north and. Oh, yeah, no, uh, Swiss Army Man. Was, yeah, yeah, Swiss Army Man. What, really? Is it a good he, film? No, he no. plays a corpse. It's, it's basically like a, a it's Winston really, from it's, you Castaway. Think, you okay. watch the trailer and you think it's going to be quite whimsy and then it's actually, actually like soul bollocks. destroying. Right. It, yeah, but also <laughs> That's why really it's so whimsy. Good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. It's, it's, if you use your penis as a compass, it generally no, no, is. No, no, but he's a corpse found on an island. And there's a guy going. It's like guy. a guy basically either crazy, like he's crazy. I mean, c- c- can I just person. point out the, the the inherent pun in compass right there? Yeah. <laughs> like, no, oh, no, don't, but... don't come inside me. I've got my compass <laughs> right here. No, no, but his no, dick... that's that's not how this works. One, just one... do it, do it on my thigh. It always keeps <laughs> pointing north. I thought it was ladies. like the, the, you know the cat that you use when you haven't got a tissue to hand. My compass. One of the things in the film. <laughs> one of the things oh, that in... poor cat. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> 
the horror. Oh my god! Could you imagine if you if you just grown up and <laughs> so I, mean, I know I know people who I mean I've I did some pretty gnarly things in my, uh, myself in my youth. Uh, I, I also know some did, people who basically they would just come off the side of their bed or they they would come on a particular bit of wall what? Yeah. onto your no floor. Cleanup, I, I've, no heard, I've, yeah. I've heard I've heard I've heard lots of interesting what the things. fuck? Could you imagine if you were the the person who's like, well, okay, like I need something <laughs> absorbing to take this up. But my I don't want it pony. to stay in my room. It's like, right, the cat. <laughs> <laughs> right, oh, where you Flat go. on the cat. It sounds like a fucking. <laughs> what's his name? Dr. Zeus's uh, <laughs> Splat book. Splat on what? the cat. Is that, is that like the fet like, Splat on the cat. Splat with ham ca- and Dr. Splat Zeus or whatever it is. Splat on the cat coming to Xbox Live. <laughs> I used to have a toy called Splat Splat the Roadkill Cat. Yeah, but oh, really? A meanie baby. A meanie baby. Yeah, they used to come with like. It's like the puppies. emo beanie I'm baby. I'm not drawing it. We're going to talk about penises for the next 20 minutes. <laughs> Do you know what? I am fucking dull with dudes talking about dicks. Raw <laughs> topic. Get used to it. We're millennials. <laughs> This is what oh, we. This shit. is the best thing we have going for us. This isn't a fucking millennial thing, man. This is just like what? Does everyone like in the next generation have small dicks? <laughs> you said this no, is the I... best thing we have going for us. Well, so we can like... we can pull them out and measure them if we need to make sure. <laughs> yeah, oh, yo, quick... I'm on the upper end of millennial. Quick... You're all below me. Quick... Oh, apart from Greg. Quick dick we check. We will not. Can we get a quick dick check, <laughs> everyone? Everyone, dick check. Everyone on the table. Right, I'll close my we eyes. Just make we'll sure play that everyone's got millennial dicks right now. Yeah. A- actually, Any- anyone? Fine. I'll pull out a fucking topic, but we're going Wait, back to it before, before, you, before you go to <laughs> that topic. I want to introduce an idea to you. Okay. Okay. Chicks with dicks. This is a cre- so, the, <laughs> no, so no, reminder. No, no, no. The, the topic is creative non-sexual uses for your dick. Yeah, no, no, apart from the topic, I want to start a new. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to talk about my dick. Hey, hey, guys, 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 guys! What? Can I stop you all? Like, I need to talk about my dick for a sec. Greg's, on, Greg's on, starting his own yeah, yeah, podcast. Yeah. Um, could you? Whisk, could you? Whisk I'm going to start a um uh like a line of pod topic to- like talk like pod topics. Topic. What the fuck? This is already <laughs> fucking beautiful. Let's go, let's go. Pod pod the pod topic pod topic top 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 well, that's what I want to ask. Well, like, to be fair, what this... sort of super weird questions can you come up with? You're not a great host no, no, if you're it's... having to ask for Mate, the questions. Write it down, put it in a pot. You're like spoiling the entire premise of our podcast right now. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. Oh, I don't think it's like, a good shot. idea. Don't spring that, that one. Idea. Idea. Because imagine the hilarity when we pull out that topic and you're not here. We're just going to impersonate you. Yeah, that's oh. going to be is, perfect. Is topic a new name for your penis? <laughs> <laughs> How did you know? Put it in the pot. <laughs> <laughs> the top pot. It, All right, it. Tom, what we got, dude? Sophie's chest. So, it's one from me. Mm-hmm. It's a two-parter. Again, I'm going oh, I'm to just read out oh, the first bit A two-parter bit from Tom. Can it's I get a ring? Two-parter Tom. Two part Tom, they call me. Mm-hmm. Uh, so, <laughs> what's your... Two, it matches the amount of genitals you have. What is your karaoke track? And if you don't have one, you have to pick one. Oh, uh, uh, but... Uh, this shit is bananas, Gwen Stefani. B a n a n s. Oh man! Like, How it, did I do that? That's whiskey mouth and love of Stefani. Because <laughs> <I mean, laughs> you to fucking love that shit. There, there's yeah. no, there's, there, there's no other way of, of no, existing, right? That's an absolute tune. I went to a high school and know her mum. I what? <laughs> what? I'm oh, sorry. Sometimes whimsy from you really catches me off guard. <laughs> I know. I went to a high school and I know her mum. <laughs> All the boys say, hey, uh, yeah, oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I, fuck you, <laughs> no, the poser, whimsy, that hashtag reference. poser. <laughs> what, was the, what was the question again? What? What's your karaoke why, song? Why, your, what, mime, Greg, mime, what are you miming to mime, me? Greg, just me, talk. Cast me the topic. No, I can't. It's a two part of the second part. Oh, okay. Yeah, Wait, yeah. I do, I do, <laughs> it's I, karaoke yeah. track. Pick a karaoke I, track. I, I so, so, karaoke so part number one is your karaoke track. So I'd have to do that... Well, I don't have a karaoke track, but if I was going to have one, it'd be that song, Me on Fire, You on Fire, Feeling Hot, 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 just for the sentiment. Mm. It's like, I'm on fire, you're on fire, or quite hot. It's like, oh, it's good. Straightforward, that's you know, good. it's real, real lyrics, you know, you don't get a lot of that these days. I think. Oh, it's, it's very straightforward and literal, which I, I can appreciate. Exactly. I, I'm literally on fire, you're literally on fire. Yeah, yeah. feeling and, hot. And, and we're both feeling hot. Yeah, hot, hot, hot. That makes exactly. sense. We've got time to pen this tune and record it in the studio. I just, I just while love being on fire. I just love, fine. like, in modern society, you get a lot of, like, fake truths, but that's just, like, honest. 
It's true. It's, it's we right are all there. It's, it's, on it's, fire. It's, is it satirical? Are you talking about the <laughs> general political climate? <laughs> no. Feeling hot, hot, hot. <laughs> oh, no, well, currently, maybe. <laughs> um, for me, it is several different impersonations. Of, so I, I, I made a, a YouTube channel. Uh, a here, YouTube we, playlist here we go. Called just, yeah. Karaoke Hard Mode, which is just <laughs> pretty much absolute bollocks i mean on there is napalm deaths Feeling you suffer girl, which is i want to oh. hurt him hurt him do, do, do. I've, I've just performed my karaoke already but oh wicked yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah you suffer by napalm death he's like he's... <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> um <laughs> also yeah, yeah even flow by pearl jam because mm. you don't need to know the lyrics Oh, that sounds amazing. You should make a track. I'm going to yo do yo yo yo. Or it's Hyper Ballad Björk. Oh, we yeah. live on a mountain. <laughs> Drop the top the beautiful view. Oh, we top of the mountain. It's my best person impersonation. <laughs> that was tacky. That, 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 that was pretty good. good. That was pretty good. It's tacky. Yeah, it's yeah. yeah. tacky. I thought I thought you were taco, impersonating Kentucky. Taco, taco, burrito, taco, taco. <laughs> Burrito, burrito. Love you, Ben Affleck. Um, or it's uh, it's my Robert Smith, which is just like heaven. Show me, show me, show me how you do that track. <laughs> the one that makes me scream, she said. The one that makes me laugh, she said. She threw her arms around my neck. So did the first bit again? <laughs> what, Robert Smith? Show me, show me, show me how you do that track. <laughs> <laughs> that was good. But yeah, that, that, those are my four. I mean, but, I've, I've um, never, does I've anyone never, have a favourite? I mean, yeah, I mean, yeah, yeah, the last one. The last one. Oh, you want to go Robert Smith just Rob, like Robert Smith, yeah. Okay, yeah, fine. Yeah, yeah. Cool. So that's mine. <laughs> See, I want to go fully sentimentality, like go back to the old school movies. Silver chair in it, you fucking It's like Prodigy, but for charity. Actually, no, I've decided... Um, <laughs> One of, one of two, I've decided. Did you, you just shout out Pendulum? <laughs> it's like prodi- <laughs> like Prodigy. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you were Pendulum. Fuck off. <laughs> <laughs> Don't you diss Pendulum in front of me. Uh, <laughs> fuck Pendulum, I'll say it. I mean, I mean in, in the same thing, you could say it's like... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Modern infection mushroom is just Ace Ventura for charity. <laughs> Buy it, Israel. <laughs> Buy it, Israel. They're Israeli. Oh. Well, I thought you said you can tell by mushroom. the side tribe. Like, inflected like, like mushroom. I, I no longer like inflected <laughs> mushrooms. Unrelated. I, I prefer to say chest newt mushroom. <laughs> <laughs> Shiitake. 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 I barely knew her. Enoki mushroom. <laughs> Enoki mushroom. <laughs> Bouton! No, no, it's all about <laughs> Boris the mushroom. Bracket. <laughs> Bracket mushroom. Sorry, uh, you were going to say so something. So, Greg, yeah, something about yeah. Pendulum, I don't remember. No, it, was, it had nothing to do with Pendulum. It had everything to do with Pendulum. I, I hardly that. know. It goes way back before Pendulum, thank you. Damn, I'm going me. full 2004. No, way before. I'm like, I'm in 1998 here. So, Holy Pendulum. Holy shit. Yeah, no, no, I've got Under the Boardwalk. From beaches under the board. Well, that yeah. song didn't come out in the 1990s. No, it was 1988. Yeah. Does, does 80, that, 80, just, yeah. <laughs> or 1988 is in the 90s, guys. <laughs> you don't know that. <laughs> Karaoke track. Yeah. yeah or it's not 90s though. Right? Or in current comparison to that one is you are the wing beneath my wing. Okay, so you got to okay. pick one. Or we pick one for you. You guys can pick one for me. Neither. We, wind Beneath My Wings, because yeah, I know how long beneath... that track is and how that, high the notes get. That, that track's like uh, Lord of the Rings, the Two Towers uh, extended version. It's like that extra bit. Yeah, I know. I no, like looking at me, not the mic, yeah. Oh, sorry. Oh, we heard you. Yeah, oh, you get used to it after a while. <laughs> yeah. You know, like a podcast. And then, and then I leave, and then I leave, and then come back in like three months and forget again. Oh, that's not our fault. Johnny, did you get I one? Invited, well, bitch. I mean, immediately <laughs> came to my head was "You Give Love a Bad Name" by Bon Jovi. I'd like to oh, do that. Well, well, you give a love well, oh, a well, bad well, name. Well, 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 please, well, you can well, do it now. Let's please, go. Please look up. Well, 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 Johnny, you used to well, work on it. No, that's living on a prayer. Well, 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 Same difference. Well, it's Bon Jovi. And you're too. <laughs> See, like you mix them together. Like Johnny used to work on the angel share. Well, 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 Johnny got a try. 
It's down on his luck. Shut through the heart. Okay, no, bad radio. Bad radio. Like, just let... No, bad radio. Could you give love a bit? Look at that waveform. Absolutely no one should have to endure that. Okay, we... Shot through the love and your two name, baby. You give Johnny... A bad uh, dick, a bad <laughs> dick. Uh, okay. No, the only either most that similar or, either between that the two or, of um, these. Guar's fucking an animal. That, that would be like that would <gasps> be fucking an animal. Fucking an animal. Rick is the only one not dancing. Fucking an animal. Is the chore is very warm in here. Greg has clearly not. Eat my animal. No, I'm not. Okay. Right. Have we all got a track then? Is that everyone named? Yes. Yeah, Luke, I mean, you got uh, one to be fair, for me, it's probably... Luke, um... Luke, what's yours? Oh, and John Cage is four minutes and 12 no, Luke, seconds. No, right, Luke, Luke, <laughs> come on. I did mine already, did I? M- no, no, ho- mine's hollow. We need it nailed down. It is for sure. B-A-N-A-N-A-S. B-A-N-A-N-A-S. B-A-B-N-A-N-A-S. What's that song that goes, banana, what's my name? What's that one? What? It's Rihanna. Yeah, but it's... I think it's called What's My Name by Rihanna. <laughs> All right, yeah. so that's yours, oh, yeah? Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay second part. You're talking about, like, What's My Name Again, sung by Rihanna. Yeah. Bring okay. 182's What's My Name Again, sung yeah, by exactly. Rihanna. That's the one. <laughs> no, no, no. Actually, what's no, My no, Name no, Again, Where's no, My no, Asian no, Friend? No, no, no. I've, got, I've got Alien Ant Farm's cover of Michael Jackson, Smooth Criminal. Mm. Okay, all right, cool. Tune. Alien Ant Farm, Smooth Criminal. Yeah, right. What's part my name again? It's number one at the end. Like, part oh, outside two. In, like, <laughs> part two. Yeah. And it's a Saturday afternoon, so we've got plenty of time. Twitch Sings now exists. What, what the fuck is Twitch Sings? What, so what, what streaming it? karaoke now exists. <laughs> Well, hang on, wait, so, wait, so wait, Twitch wait. is trying to get on some of the let's musically. See, let's see the end of the A statement. long time ago, might give us in a galaxy far, far might away. Might give us context, so might give us context. So, my favourite thing at the moment is watching Limmy, the Scottish comic, mm. on <laughs> Twitch Sings. <laughs> because it is amazing, because he does duets with other people. Unsuspecting random right, people. Right, right. <laughs> it's Wait, I, so good. This is a bit. This is a bit separate. But have you guys seen the Slavic guy on Twitch that just dances to like the most Russian tunes ever and just drinking vodka and doing like these mad Russian? No, tunes. but I will give him my Prime I'll, membership I'll, I'll subscription. Send you, I'll send, I promise you. Every I prom- month, if he, he, he's I'm giving it to Limit at the moment. There's, it's like the biggest video of him is called the, the, the biggest Slav on Twitch. <laughs> and biggest it, Slav. And it's the same. Dancing to absolute Russian tunes, dressing like a beanie and like Russian gear, smoking vodka. Is that smoking, smoking vodka? <laughs> well, it, that's it, some LA turtle shit right there. Is that Twitch stream a like a byproduct or or like a ev- evolution? Jesus Christ, Greg! Is it like an evolution of the whole carpool karaoke? No, no, it's like an no, evolution of karaoke. No one would want to be associated with the guy. I can't remember his name, but he's a cunt. Who's the guy? Jeremy that? Hunt. Yeah, Jeremy Hunt. It's scavenger yeah, it's, cunt. Who does car ho- carpool karaoke? <laughs> you scavenger Jeremy cunt. Hunt. You <laughs> scavenger Who is it does, does carpool karaoke? Um, oh. um, no, j- Dickheads uh, from Northern Northern twat face. Uh, that, 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 that English dude. <laughs> yeah. 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 That piece of shit. That yeah. fucking James Thank Gordon. Gordon. That was See, so uh, informative. That, I love that it. projects my, my exact point. That right. Everyone cool. hates him. Second point. <laughs> a big Twitch big. Sings exists, and this is now a thing. Yeah. We are contractually obliged to do it today. <laughs> oh, God. Okay, well, How do we live stream karaoke? Twitch. Just today. Oh, I don't yeah. know what Twitch is. Sorry. I can do it. I, uh, Twitch is a streaming platform that no, you can wait, hook you, up I'm, a I'm I'm gonna gonna camera, gaming. We can do it. Yeah. It doesn't yeah. matter. Oh, let's do it. Let's the do it. The ghetto oh, is we'll the do it. We'll do it. Hands in. So we're all going to do karaoke in. today yeah. to the songs that we've wait, mentioned. Wait, wait, so all do write it. them down so, now. Hands, I, mine's up yeah. here. It's fine. But yeah, yeah, yeah. oh, I, wait. So, you, sorry. Hands talk. in for people sorry. who are going to do cross talk. Stop arguing. Come on. What's up? Are you saying that the thing that caused the the like explosion on the sound there? We're going to be doing together a lot. Yeah. Yes. Okay. Great. Just, just. Oh, are yeah. we doing it as a group? Like a, like no. a, a one, oh, 
individually we, we sing have our songs. Individual five karaoke tracks. I'm assuming Bearing people mind, can join five, if they want. Not whoa, five whoa, whoa. each. Not five. No, 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 no one, each. one each. Oh, okay, There's okay. five of us, mate. Ooh. Yeah, we're going to do twenty-five Chill. songs for the next four hours. Oh, is that, oh, is Although, that, oh, is that, as you propose it, Luke, let's do that because yes. I, I have that four. Songs. I we're not going to stop singing until sundown. That's the rule. <laughs> All right, well, we've chosen our tracks, and it is going to be uploaded onto this Twitch. If we can pull through, the links will be in the show notes. Yes, I will do it. I'll, even if it I'll, requires... t- I'll rip them Sorry. from Twitch and put it on YouTube. Sorry, are you are you seriously suggesting we're going to do a Twitch stream? Yep. Yeah. Okay, fine. Not suggesting. I Working on it. I think it's set in stone. Mike, just, I've, I've just, got my just, laptop just, here, dude. Just get fine. ready for it, bitch. Oh, are bitch. you doing a shout out on Somo? What? So me, or whatever what? you call it. When? This is a new thing in my company, by the way. Referring to social media as so me. Oh, okay, I I, I, cool. I've got my. Have you, you hashtag that yet? No. I, I, I've, I've veered away from uh, Hollaback Girl because. Um, no, you're doing Hollaback Girl. You no, I'm name, not. no, you no, are. No, you can't go back. You, are. you can't go back. We picked it. We you're doing, doing Hollaback Girl. Yep. Said. You've already made your decision. That's no, you can do a second one to prove your worth. What was that song by Miley Cyrus? I will do a second one. What was my song? By Mighty Cyrus. Wrecking Ball. Was there a Mighty Cyrus song you really like? We'll listen back. Wrecking Ball? <laughs> yeah, because I don't remember. Anyway, guys, this is quickly becoming Logistics, the podcast. So can we just get on with the topic? Welcome to this week's episode of Logistics, the podcast. One, 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 point, one, one. FM. All right, okay. Cool. Next topic. So we're going to do this <laughs> afterwards. Uh, so, yeah, go for it. This is Luke. this is the podcast of digitalization one one zero 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 one 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 zero 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 one 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 zero. Oh, smell the shed. Oh, so good. This shed is bananas. B a n a n shed. A asbestos. <laughs> oh, what? So this one is from. Doesn't say. It does say. I can read it from here. It says just juice. Oh, but that's a person. <coughs> Okay. Well, Just Juice said, <laughs> what was your last victory? My, I think actually making everyone commit to doing karaoke on Twitch. <laughs> Wait, no, no, that so, will be a victory when it happens. Before that. Oh, no, before no, that. Oh, oh, come yet. on, let's just do it. No, I'm yeah, up for it. I'm, I'm well it, up for it. It hasn't happened yet. That's so, what I'm saying. Talking yeah. to the I'd mic, say, fam. I'd, I'd say, oh, sorry. Getting mo- Luke to talk into the mic, fam. Sorry, That's my latest victory. I, 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 Just I, take his face to it. It's look, fine. look, look! I'm too involved in people to like look at a wall. Do these people Which know that you're involved in them? No. Bullshit. <laughs> That's the, no, no. But what was your last victory? My last victory was going from I going from an anxious state to a completely normal state. Like on my own without even having to talk to someone else, and I know that sounds ridiculous, but no, that doesn't there's, sound ridiculous. There's so, there's so many times where, like, I, like I suffer from anxiety, and I'd I'd get into this ridiculous mindset where absolutely nothing's wrong, but I I keep feeling like there's loads of problems, and I'm looking everywhere, and I'm I'm pulling apart like things that are great and making them bad, mm-hmm. and I went from a state like that to completely calm, and in fact, really enjoying my day in under an hour by going outside and th- just dealing with my thoughts. I, I think everyone around this table will identify with that very well. I propose... Like being able to do I, I mean, I won't. I work at the end. I get no time to spend outside. Yeah. I, propo- <laughs> I propose a absolutely... Yeah, no, totally. Uh, well, well done. No, that, that takes that, a lot. Does that make you feel that anxious? That does take a lot. Mental health. <laughs> no, it does when it does when it <laughs> it does when everyone's looking. Are you fucking now? I feel enlightened. Yeah. <laughs> mental health is something that people these days don't put enough effort into. But they are mental about, which is funny. <laughs> yeah. No, but I, that I should be the only line that any Danny Dyer's is allowed to say. mental. Health. So, <laughs> I'm, I'm, as a serious point, it's mental. <laughs> ah, yeah. oh, it's a depression, bruv. <laughs> <laughs> as a serious people point people like if you're having problems if you have mental health issues or if you are feeling down about yourself don't listen to the podcast it won't help <laughs> nah remember nah. <laughs> that you have family and friends that love you and will listen to you because you've just killed someone greg you do realize that and someone who no, doesn't have any friends or family if you, if just you killed no no one that will listen to them and you've now. actually yeah, given they, license to and self. You've murdered uh, someone right, now right, greg right, right. i hope you feel and if you, you, you know what let, let's, let's let's have a pause for earnestness just, just one. Carry on, Greg. Let's have a yeah. second silence. Okay, okay, okay. Two seconds. 
<laughs> Fuck off, Greg. <laughs> <laughs> you know, it's important these days to understand what social media is doing to people's mental health. Okay, oh, okay, no, no, we're getting to no, 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 right now. It's no, 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 look after yourself and your latest victory. Not feeling well enough. Please submit your topics on Facebook. So that was my latest victory. I'm sorry for leading us down this path. Okay, you made a very lovely point. I should be applauded. Yeah, I write. I just believe that's something that be, people these days should look after themselves. That's all. They awesome. should. I mean, I've, well, I've, I've yeah. already spoken about my latest victory. I've, 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 maybe there's there's one that's come after that, but just like making up extension leads for the first time ever. That that was that was fun. A and moment engaging. where you could realise that and, plus and negative, you can make it work. Well, so okay, the problem, the real problem I had with it is. Like, Did you remember Earth? Uh, Do you remember uh, Earth? Earth is Did easy as fuck. Yeah. Earth is always green He's a stripy cunt, isn't he? No, yeah, he's, 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 he's little the little guy. stripy bastard. Oh. Easy. The other one, the the only way I can Brown play, and blue. The only throws way you I... off. You're thinking red and black. Nope. Nope. No, no, no. Brown Do, and blue. Should I tell you how I how I got over? No, no, no please no, don't. Two, no, no, for no, the no. sake of endurance, please no, don't. Tom. I agree with that. The, the way the, the way I fixed in mind, which is which is live, which is neutral, is like, well... It it's the one blue that shocks plug, you. doesn't it? Blue's neutral, so neutral. No, but simple blue's, as that, man. Blue's not always neutral. I hate neutral. you with everything of my blue's. being. <laughs> it's what it took. It's what it took. It's what it took. Neutral. Excellent. I know where that goes now. And then understand how electrons work and you're realize like how wor- wrong that statement might actually you're be. You're like the worst Metro it's Prime player. It's still better than positive and negative. Okay, fine. What? Who the fuck? <laughs> I mean, like the thing is, there's there was two there was two sets, wasn't there? there was, sorry, well, I didn't think anyone would be listening to this. I thought this was going to be edited. Well, no, everyone's no silent, so carry on talking. No, no. So yeah, there was two. There was it was the what was it the brown? The, it was the brown was for live, and then it turned to red. Whereas blues always stayed neutral, right? Is that correct? What? No, no, because it was it was red and black and uh, green brown for no. Earth, wasn't it? No, it's DC. AC, AC is and DC, brown yeah. and blue. Yeah, brown and blue. Yeah, that's what I was saying. Well, I mean, did, uh, did you know what? A boring conversation. No, I, that's what no, I was this saying. This is fascinating. You brought it up, fam. You, you told me to be, you told everyone to be quiet. I thought we were just having a combo that's going to get cut out. God. So, I hope we have more content than this. So, my, la- my latest victory, and I'm going to make this as a sub-genre of a genre victory, is that... Last night, uh, not last night, Thursday night, I went out with out with the other team leaders and we were playing ping pong and... He shot one from his anus. No. Uh, <laughs> what, like, it would only be the good other, if someone the caught it with their mouth. Was, the, the others were <laughs> so their bad. Own anus. The, like, <laughs> the others were so bad that I became really nonchalant about my shots. <laughs> <laughs> like I was just standing there in a pose just going, yeah. And just smacking it and just killing them all. It's all like coding. If, you, it's if your like cock's coding. a bit indifferent, it would be a nonchalant, just, wouldn't it? <laughs> yeah, the exactly. cock's indifferent. Yeah, nonchalant. The cock's I don't know if I'm happy or... Uh, what, is that the new metal band name? Cock's yeah, indifferent. Yeah, cock's indifferent. <laughs> yeah. Um, all right, okay. uh, my latest victory was uh, understanding the importance of toilet etiquette. Yeah. Wait, wait, wait. I believe... There are many etiquettes. I, I, I believe I, you I, need to go into more I detail. Went out. What's his toilet, toilet so, etiquette? Don't stand so, on ceremony. I, I share a bathroom, right? <laughs> okay. I mean, in, in living... I um, mean, shared accommodation, basically. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Right. So, I went out and I bought a bog brush. Mm. I quickly realised toilet paper's more effective. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> Bit painful, right? Thank right, you. At that jokes on Twitter and Very Instagram. <laughs> Crawling <laughs> through uh, okay. my skin. Crawling to the sink. Uh, like <laughs> Greg, Johnny, shut Johnny, up. What, Johnny, what's your most recent accomplishment? Oh, getting a permanent contract at work for sure. Hey. Hey. <laughs> Magnificent. All good. Welcome to the adult world. I can occasionally get paid to not do things. <laughs> Yay. <laughs> so. Uh, I, welcome over, to my life, to be fair. <laughs> over, over the, Sometimes um, I drink. <laughs> over the podcast chat, uh, uh, Beth, I think, may have provided us with the fi- perfect final topic. Yes. Go on. Do you like tw- tongue twisters? Twang twisters. Do I like twang twisters? Yeah, I really like my twang twisters. What are your favourites? 
So uh, we, we've already kind of dealt with this a little bit with uh, distant uh, cinnamon synonyms. Oh god, yeah, cinnamon synonyms. As, as is also, great. it's a very good tongue twister. Go on, really go on, try it. Mm-hmm. Go on. Cinnamon synonym. Cinnamon synonym. Dissonant synonym. 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 Oh, dissonant synonym. Sorry. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> try that Tom, twice. You got, you got a favourite tongue twister? Mm-hmm. My sister. Uh, <laughs> Greg. Gnarly. Na- j- gnarly, call, gnarly, call- boom, bum, barley. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go, Greg. I, I would say foreplay. <laughs> I mean, imagine drilling, you drilling Beth like uh, M. Bison. With imagine. Your <laughs> come join us. Hashtag <laughs> FetLife. Sorry, Greg. Carry on. No, no, that's fine because I'm going to accentuate that point thing. with it's also featuring feet. That's no feet. feet. <laughs> well, obviously, because Tom, Beth, feet, porno. Do you know, it really There's very it little doesn't... you can do to a woman with feet, whereas the things you can do with a man, <laughs> man, but women, with women, feet, women, when you've cut the feet off, doesn't put me off. It's a world of possibility. It doesn't put me off. Okay. 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 Usually, okay. it's you need to be more creative. Big fecky, <laughs> as I like to call him. Tom, Tom would know. Tom. Tom, I, I would suggest that there's actually a huge amount you can do with feet. If you start with the premise of you grab someone by the feet and then swing. I don't know. That increases I mean, that the like range. Titanic? No, well, that, that's, that's, yeah, yeah. yeah that, it increases it, the range yeah, of what you can do know, with feet I think that decreases the range because that's what, you can only do what's within swinging. Well, that's why if you if you grab someone by the feet, feet that's the beautiful yeah, but, thing about swinging, darling. As I rub your thighs, it's all inclusive. Fair. Hashtag okay. fit life. Hashtag then I feel sorry life. for Clusive. <laughs> if you add into that all of the extra things outside First child of just is going feet. to be called. <laughs> if you add in hashtag. <laughs> hashtag. Hashtag. Inclusive. And the second one. Clusive. Fit life, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I want to be in. Clusive. Yeah, no, the second one oh. will be twins. It will be Clusive and fit life. <laughs> sorry. Go so on, Greg. Greg. Yeah, if you add into feet. Or like this, the subgenre of feet well, like feet squared. Fetish. Feet squared. Then you add, you can add all those extra things, like, like, uh, well, well, no, okay, good. Like, like what are the extra things that have <laughs> toes? Toes, yeah. What are those things that attach to feet? Toes. <laughs> could, could you imagine? You having, answered your own fucking question. Yeah, could you yeah, imagine yeah, having yeah. a corn fetish? No, no, a yeah, corn exactly. Fetish, like, or corn that's a subgenre of corn. Corn, yeah. corn. corn. Like, like, foot, foot wait, corn. C or K. C or K. Oh, foot, foot corn. Oh, wait, wait, C or K. No, or, C, but on your feet. Uh, corn fetish. Oh, yeah, or, or you yeah, would do nothing more than lick. Like, I love those nubbins. Skin. Give me yeah, them I'd, tasty, tasty nubbins. Did la, la, you see corn? You, uh, you, like you see corn cl- tasty claim they invented dubstep? You can't get the roughness anywhere else. Did you see corn claim they invented dubstep? Did yeah. you see that? And mushrooms, apparently. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, I'm still yeah. but no, corn, no, it, corn invented magic mushrooms, ladies and gentlemen. World exclusive. Silla all up inside her. Like, anyway, it, Tom, we're so, done. No, no, I can, uh, I can, uh, I can give you a Turkish tongue twist. I if think you like. we should oh. end here. Oh, that sounds good. Okay. Yeah, it goes, yeah, like, yeah, yeah, it goes right. like this: Hafyon, sorry, Hafyon Karadasala Lashtar Maduk Larastamasnus. Hafyon Karadasala Lashtar Maduk Larastamasnus. It means there's a castle in 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 Hafyon where some people are hanging out. There you are. Oh my stick God. that, stick that in your shisha and Turkish fuck endurers off. reach out. Mm. Yeah, stick that in your shisha. Stick and them fuck kebabs off. in the air. Endurers. I would you love to hear even... exactly how wrong he was. We need to get Oskay on. Have you right. the last term of the Next, Next week on the podcast, oh, Oskay Rick- comes in. He's a lyrical boy. Like I bet he's got that nailed. Yeah, no. I don't know any actual words in Turkish, but that I know. What that whole <laughs> phrase? Hello <laughs> to beers. I bet you can do that. That's his and Oskay's sex. Sex phrase, like it's it's a safety phrase. Sorry, yeah. I, if I can't get out in no, full, no, she carries no, on. I mean, <laughs> we, what? No. Yeah, let's. Really, you want to cut the episode now? Yeah, oh, we're, dun, we're close. Dun, we're just getting into the good dun, stuff. Dun, oh, we should get into the good dun, stuff. All right, let's go. Were we about to talk about more non-sexual uses for penises? I think we were. Yeah. <laughs> so, as a herb grinder, Ooh. If we, no one said it had to work. Yeah, yeah I agree with Taz. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> to, sharp, <laughs> to sharpen the herb scissors. There we go. Taryn, what's up? Are you done? Are you getting warm? Oh, he's getting naked. No, he's, he's fully naked. So, on my I right... So, does see anyone have anything to plug while Taryn's naked? Because I'm sure he will. 
So I'm not gonna lie, I'm gonna tug Plar- Taren- Taren's naked body because it it looks all right. Like I can't well, lie, th- I'm, is... not, I'm not gonna judge that. Like, it looks pretty good. Like it's a bit of a saggy or... sack, but I mean, I don't <laughs> yeah, want to give you a complex. Like, like, saggy saggy if we're talking about wait, clothes no, no, here, no, no, wait, 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 Stop. Remember, we're doing a show. Yeah, I Ish. started my plug. Are we plug. still recording? No, yeah. we're still recording. <laughs> I started my uh, plug. Right, Johnny, have you got anything to plug? <laughs> Fuck you. We'll get to you. No. Wicked. <laughs> Great. Anything to plug? Well, there's some really uh, interesting shaped um, salt and pepper shakers over there. <laughs> <laughs> Wicked. Greg. <laughs> That's a plug? no. That's a hard pass from Greg. This just in. Tom, any plugs? Oh, wait, yeah. why'd you skip yeah. me? No, no, we're leaving you to last because you were most emphatic, I no, think. No, I think Taron's racist. I am. I'm, it's I'm, I'm absolutely the only... you racist. It's so look up face, spelt P-H-A-C-E, and <laughs> Mephuse, spelt Mephuse. And uh, M-E-F-J-U-S. the single they've just put out together is Link Zero One. It's shit. I fucking like it. I'm joking, I haven't had it. Oh, it's really good. <laughs> uh... Tom, in edit, put in that little bit from uh, Neverkin Skilson track. Hit. Sweet. Uh, to be honest, is that bit that goes. Oh, oh yeah. that, it, no, it, I know. I can plug. Sorry. At, if we're well, looking at the other version of well, plug, then um, yes, go to Bounce Old Street. It's an absolutely lovely venue. It's a great first date location. They do two for one drinks between five and nine, five and seven. So you go in there and you get pissed. So you can treat your first date to what is clearly a bog standard cheap drink. Next okay, up, here we are. Nando's and so, the cinema next week on this podcast. Johnny. So, hello. Uh, first of all, go to the Electric Cinema in Notting Hill and then lie on a bed and watch a film. It's yeah, wonderful. And most... then do that for an early matinee. And then when you leave, go and see my wife's fucking shoe stall in... on Portobello Road. Yes, Definitely. absolutely. In the market. Definitely. She makes vegan custom made shoes. I know. Don't are ask. Are they vegan <laughs> shoes? Yeah, yeah they are, yes, aren't they? they are. Yes, they really? Are. Yes, they yeah. are. Oh, like premium courgette leather. That's why that, That's why she's got a store. Yeah. Wicked. Just to add awkwardness, and her uh, friends that are also running it are kind of attractive. You, you don't listen to Greg. He's a really? Mm. He is an mm. absolute person. Well, to find out, well, you'll have day. to go down and see Osgay yeah. at Portobello Road Market. Mm. Which you should do, but not under the circumstances. Well, like obviously, we're not advocating... Do you want to fuck vegan shoes? Friends. Do you want to fuck attractive people? <laughs> go to Portobello <laughs> Road Market. Buy some shoes. And Tarot you days. might um, see one okay, of them. Okay, so uh, if you want to go see and read some of my writing, you're not paying enough attention to yourself. But if that's the case in where you are, uh, please check out fourgreattruth.wordpress.com and you can find uh, my Deus Ex uh, horror blog uh, that I did years and years Four ago. Great truth spelled as it sounds. Yeah. Four Great Great Truth. No spaces. Um, also, you can do a search for uh, the Blissland Massacre. That's Blissland spelled B. It's actually easier to find it via the WordPress URL, to be fair. For great yeah. truth at yeah. dot wordpress.com. Give me everything because I've needs. had to do it twice now. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking, I need to take everything off that site at some point. Amazon. Anyway, sorry, go there on Amazon, Amazon and then find uh, Fuck Amazon. walking out. Yeah, I met Dean Spencer this week. That was oh, something you did? I did. Who did oh, the artwork artist. for yeah, yeah. Uh, Taron's book, Walking Out, which you can find on Amazon. Uh, go to podtopicpodcast.com, click God, on About, bitch. and you will find a link to it. God, Follow his art, man. He's fucking... But Dean I Spencer, I should be it's the moment of him. sitting down in a pub with someone and going, holy shit, I've been following you on Facebook for like four years. Mm. <laughs> it's quite weird. And... Cue the music. Share and tell a friend. It's the only way we're going to get more listeners. Uh, pot, uh, eat, submit a pot topic podcast by going to pottopicpodcast.com. Submit a topic and submit in the topic. You can email audio pot audio topics to emails at polpot.co.uk. And Taron? Uh, 
big thank you to uh, Arrange for the use of their tunes, uh, Triples with Three P's. With Three P's. With You can buy Triples with Three P's. Um, the self-titled album, A Rang of Fruit, with which, a, which a, a, a um, um, uh, And, uh, yeah, they're all on okay, yeah, Wobbly Records. Piece. Find them on SoundClouds, find them on uh, Bandcamps, and find them on the other places. Monkey Fist, you find all the Scotch places. Lobster. And also, yeah, they, 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 they they're now do a new band, uh, new band, the Scotch Lobster and Monkey Fist, so go check that shit out. Great reviewers, I'm going to say a massive drunk out of ten. And with that, can I get a absolute speed boss? Very close to the mic, so we get some distortion on it. I'm going to bust 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 it. I've got fog on my pop shield. You're fogging your pop shield. Oh, it got wet. It got wet. Can I just, wow. can I just apologise disingenuously for biting Luke's finger? <laughs> it fucking hurt. Let me have a go. <laughs> <laughs>